Hello, everybody. Hopefully, it's all going good. On this fine fucking Wednesday, I think. I think it's fucking Wednesday. All right. But yes, hello. We are back. We're doing the thing. We're slaying the princess for the last time, probably. We don't we don't have that much left. We just really have to get the the routes we haven't uh It's Wednesday, yes. Thank God. The days the days and their names are just a concept. Alright, I can't I can't keep track of these things. Anyway, um Shadow Wizard Money Gang. We love casting <laughs> spells. That's true actually. Uh I hate Wednesdays, but yes, okay. I'm a bit of a, a, bit of a, a bit of a, a Wednesday. A Monday! I was gonna say Monday, but I can't speak. I'm actually terrible about that, though I stream. I know, it's really funny. Uh. Fucking hell. Um. Yes. We have Slay the Princess we're going to do today. It should be the last stream. Should be. Of the game. Uh, I have, I have, I have the, I have the flow chart up, the whole, whole flow chart up, so I know what we need to do, what we gotta do, all that good stuff. So, basically, uh, I think if I read it correctly, uh, the pristine cut adds, uh, the clearly you played the game before. Yes, yeah, it's the, uh, fourth day. It was the, uh, fourth, fourth, fourth day. Originally, kind of like a bonus little like sp spooky month thing, and I'm just like, man, this game is fucking great. I'm gonna keep playing this, and then we just, we just, we just been going through like all the routes like slowly. Uh, it's been fun. I've been very much enjoying it. How many more do you have to go? I think there's literally like four or five left. I think like four or five, and then just like we gotta get the the interesting endings, I guess. Yeah, you know, let's just not. Yeah, let's not dilly dally. All right, let's just fucking let's uh, get down to business and open the open the game. Uh, achievements. I have sixty-one out of one hundred and thirty-one. That's a lot. That's a lot. Yeah. Like looking over there, and I'm looking at the flow chart, just, just so you know. Uh, okay, blah 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 blah. Horror game, it's it's spooky, it's also a dating sim, kind of. Kind of. All right, just so everyone's refreshing or anything, this is how many vessels we've gotten. We are missing literally four of them left. There's four, not a lot left, and uh, we have to get like. Fucking all this shit down here, which I'm pretty sure is because uh, I'm looking at I was looking at the thing, the chart, and apparently I think I get I think the pristine cut adds like this thing where we have to get particular types of vessels, and we know we've gotten the right one when we get to the end, and there's like the little the little funny like red text we would get right. The funny, uh, the funny red text we'd get. We need, we need that. We need, like, the funny, the funny red text. That's, like, important. Apparently. Uh, I think that gets us the new ending? I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, but, we're, we're, but the point is, there's an ending there we haven't gotten. There's also, uh, when we might. Uh, yes, the funny red text. Yes, yes, it's very funny. Uh, Right, like harsh vessels. We need like harsh vessels. I don't know what 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 that is. It's like at the end when like she's showing you like all like the vessels you collected throughout the throughout the run. Uh, and at like the top is usually like a specific piece of text that's at the top. If you have a certain certain a certain vessel. Uh, it'll have like red text like when you. 
hover your mouse over it. It's it's yeah. Uh yeah, basically I'm just trying to end this run we're gonna do well getting the ones we haven't gotten while also getting a harsh uh a harsh princess, essentially. Uh, we're gonna see because I need to Yeah, I need to figure shit out. I think this is like a special thing, but um oh oh I also know that we have to we have to get the stranger as like the first one for another one, so I might like do like a little bit of like like a like a speed run one. Maybe like kinda go through and get like some of the other things we haven't gotten, I guess. Oh dude, yeah. So yeah, we gotta we got, we got, we got some fucking, we got, we got some fucking work to do. So, I think the first order of business. Hmm. Although I think, I think the thing is with the stranger, by the way, is that that kind of like locks us into a certain route if we do her first. I think. I think anyway. I think, hold on, I was managing, making sure. Tell me what happens when you get Stranger first. I think you know another thing about it. Yeah, sure. I mean, look, we've already, we've already played through the game like three times. Like a little bit of a spoiler, like isn't isn't that big big of a deal. I've seen, like, we've seen like all of this. Like we 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 we, we we've seen a lot. Like it's it's fine. It, it 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 doesn't it doesn't matter. Um. Yeah, I don't know, cause, cause, cause last time, like, like, we got like some like the others, like the main, the main thing we got like uh, last time was like this type of thing here, and I wasn't like super satisfied with that, but yeah, you know. yeah, you know, cause like I'm trying to get like, oh, go back to where it all started. We have a bit of a contrarian, like there's like all this, and like I'm like, how the fuck? Cause I think what what I've been doing is just. Bring her any vessel except a stranger. Like that's, I think that's the route I kept, I kept going down. Something like, I'm sorry for this was our first place she'd come across or something. Okay. Mm hmm. See, like, I would always try and like get this, like, just sure without any outside help. Strange beginning. Might be that. I, mean, I don't know. We gotta. Is it? Yeah, no, it's five. It's Princess Slay time. You know it. I love a good moita. Also, hello, Sergen. God, I hope you're saying your name right. I can't pronounce names very well. Uh. Yes. Hello. Hello. Okay, here's what I might do. Let's go get the stranger first, and then we'll start going down our funny our funnies. And then maybe we'll try and just we'll just try and like quickly go down like a harsh thing, because that's like the two things we need to do. We need we need, we need to do the stranger one, or whatever. We need to do that. It's funny because I got the stranger on the second uh, loop back. On our yeah, on yesterday's stream, so I'm like, oh god damn it, I fucked that up. Like we have the same username color confuses me. I'm gonna change mine. I think I think I think Sergeant's is like a uh, random. I think it's like his, his, his is a different color on my end. It's on my little window that I look at. Also, God, I still wish I my 
widgets in OBS would work. Cause oh my god, I hate, I hate having to, every time like I tab over to something to go switch something, I have to read. Look, it doesn't matter. Anyway, okay, let's yeah okay, yeah let's 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 do that. Your honor, you're here. Seriously? Goodbye. Goodbye. You're mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're silent. At least like most of this. There's always uh, a choice. At least like most of this oh, we can just she will twist ignore less. You can just skip like a lot of this. The cabin interior is not gonna take it. The door to the base nothing here seems to belong. And the closer you examine, we don't even have a oh, weapon. We already tried turning around and leaving, didn't? We? And what's that? That the fate of the girl still. Mm. I saw the harsh stairs. You step to the left. The path is cruel against your feet. The impact of each step sending pulsing vibrations. No, up it's your just not bad. Nah, no, nah, nah, there's nothing nah. left in them to feel. No, no, no. Don't want to do it. The air around you grows cold the further you progress. At first, a barely noticeable drop. Quickly evolving into a ah. gold. Your toes feel neat. like blocks of ice. Your breaths puff out in <gasps> clouds of condensed vapor. Oh wait, hold on! I forgot to put up my fucking. Forgot to uh, bring out uh, my my keyboard and mouse because I'm I I'm absolutely have everything together. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, we're good. You shudder against it as you continue Everybody, down the stairway. Boo. Losing your in the bone. Ah, at the keyboard. There we go. The stairs are hard. They're very hard. And sharp. You slowly lose sense of yourself the further you go. That's nice. Time disappears. You just going to stand there? Uh maybe. What what the hell was that? What happened to us? I feel so strange. Oh well, the prince and uh, he's just being an act. Why are we busted? It's not, it's not a ghost version. Thank you. I right, thank you very much for the fall. Oh, it's good. Yeah, it's just nice. It's nice. My uh, my notifications work. I don't know why, but they were like down down at the bottom of the stream here. I don't know why. A little strange. Oh, oh, uh, it's it's like. It's like we're, we're, we're a stranger. Oh, I didn't realize I was here. Yeah, I know. I've been watching you stare at me for a long Oh my god, I'm so sorry. The shadows recede, revealing the princess's face. Is a demon the same difference? That's the... I guess. I don't think she likes us. No, not really. Wouldn't you be skeptical of someone stumbling in here if you were her? We lost oh, ourselves ah. the second we stepped into this place. I don't know how long she's been here, but Thank I can't you. imagine it would be easy for her to trust anyone. There's eyes, though. They're so sharp. Like the stairs we're walking on. It's just deception. Don't buy into it. You can do this. It's okay. Don't worry. Sometimes I get lost here, too. As the princess speaks again, it's almost as if she fractures. And where there was uh. once just one of her. There is now another. Good. I don't like this. Shit. It's those cabins all over again. Can can we put her back? Again, someone says it fractures where there was one small. Now there's another. Again? Have you been here before? I got stuff to clean my PC and put in uh put in new thermal paste coming. Nice. Nice. Hope I hope you you give you give your your PC a very nice bath. <laughs> Put lots of soap on. <laughs> Make sure he's all clean. <laughs> I'm gonna be in by 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 fucking uh, Friday. Yeah yeah, hope so too. You know you know you know, dude. It's a good it's a good thing you don't live in Canada right now because currently a uh, Canada post uh, for me right now is like on strike. So any. A a any fucking thing calling calling from there, I'm just not getting. <laughs> I ordered some Warhammer recently, and uh, I'm probably not getting that until that's over. <laughs> Cause uh, you know, you know, 
you know, you know how it is. Have you been here before? Should we tell him? Nah, let him stew. Right, I'm telling him until it's hard to describe. It seems to whatever you. Okay. Also, for this, we're just gonna uh, make sure she fractures the only picture of this I haven't gotten yet. Hey, I threat the world. I will send a slave. Do you believe that? Do you think I'm some sort of <laughs> monster? You could be. Because I am. Everything you've heard about me is true, and I'm going to lay waste to everything, starting with you. All right, cool. Thanks. Now, uh, Peace only gets a bath when the FBI or CIA shows up. I don't think we're going to be able to put her back. I suppose. I, I suppose it makes sense. Kind of hurts to think about it, doesn't it? It's like everything we say just multiplies her. He already knows, knows, so no point if they show up. And if they are, right, sure, I'm going down. I'm not going down without a fight. Yeah, if, yeah, yeah. If the IRS shows up, yeah, you, you, you might as well just do, do whatever at that point. It certainly looks that way. Yeah, fucked either way. You stop asking her questions and stop stalling. You're obviously just making things worse. What's your name? You can address me as your royal highness or her majesty. Any honorific should do, really. One insult thing before I go. You comically oversized bed, bed, vegetable. You didn't have to go for the fucking throat, Jesus. Are right, you go have a good one, Dragon. Wait, you go, you go have a good one. You can call me princess if you'd like. No, I don't need a name. My name is whatever hushed whispers follow in the wake of my devastation. Don't ask, I won't. I do not need the deep lore. I get enough deep lore from the fucking nightclub. Anyway, none of them have names. Ah! How astute. I told you she was untrustworthy. Uh. Get out of here, what are you going to do? I don't think what I'd do really matters, does it? What you do after uh, this princess? I think we're gonna do Princess and the Dragon after this, because that's the other one I haven't gotten. And I know there's a harsh route there, so we're gonna probably do that. I could tell you that I'd lead a quiet life in the woods, or that I'd open an orphanage, or that I'd do any other number of good things that I'm sure you think you want to hear. I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm interested. Nice, no, sentient Tim Hortons can. <laughs> You either trust me it's not or true that I'm dangerous. What I say won't change how you already feel about me. Besides, you already know what I'm going to do. Not a single real answer. Hmm. At least aside from Miss Blood and Destruction, it's infuriating, isn't it? Uh, Whose buttons are there for us to press? Whose skin is there for us to get under? Not exactly how I put it, but I don't disagree. There must be something we can do. Asking questions just seems to make things worse. Oh, that sounds good, 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 good to me. Okay, this was fun yeah. for a bit, but we can't even really interact with her, can we? What's the point of asking questions if all we're going to get is a million answers? I mean, it's great if you're asking questions and you just pick the answer you want. <laughs> right? Can't even follow what's going ah, on. Yeah, that works. I don't think that's how that works. We need to get out of here. This whole place is making me itch. Itchy, tasty. Uh, you know, it was weird, like being pulled apart back together. Do you know what happened to me? What? Like you need me to hold your hand and tell you everything's okay? Yes. You're not really cut out for this, are you? Why are you even here? I don't know, man. We're probably stuck down here forever, aren't we? There's no way out. I'm barely a way in. Sometimes I feel like I'm being pulled apart too. It's so terrifying down here. But at least now you're not alone. And I'm not alone either. That's true. I don't remember what it was like before I was in this place. Why would I know what happened to you? Oh, I thought they would send something better to deal with me. If the stairs managed to chew you up, I will devour you. Man, stairs are dangerous, all right? I fall down them all the time. Thank you. That's not huh. right. Too much for the follow there. Sirgin? Or game? Yeah. <laughs> Go on. You 
take a step forward. Your yeah, foot lands, names. but it lands again. Different. You experience a firm footfall, a gentle. You can feel yourself rupture. Though you find the blade suddenly in your hands, all at once you use it to strike at her bindings as you remain upstairs and slay her and leave her to languish alone. Nice. Is this what the end of the world looks like? But this. We, 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 do you not have anything? No, I, luckily for all of us. Burble, burble. Falls up. I think he's gone. We were never going to sell. What happened to us? We can feel them moving around. We should. Uh, I didn't know. It's a little late for a. Please. Please. I don't think he's supposed to be fixed. What if we were the princess all along? That'd be a fucking plot twist, wouldn't it? She's gone. And is that? I'm begging you. Ignore you. This. This stuff. Yeah. Shut. I reach for the mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. There's a fucko in my cabin. Something fun. Yes. No. These ones are a pun. I am sorry that you met this vessel so early in your journey. But they will make for a rich and vibrant heart. Do not mourn them. For they will finally get to know themselves. Hmm. Skip to Okay. Nothing as we are. There is no bring me. Okay. Anyway. She asks that I tell you to rem you won't. Do you remember? I don't. You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. Okay. Reminds me of the D and D joke, well, where the female dragon born of Haladin gets a quest to the princess of an evil dragon. And if I'm hearing the details, she is both princess. Uh, she's both the princess, uh, the dragon, and. Now the noble knight. So she became like all of those things? I guess. Oh wait, no, no, oh wait, no, yeah, the fuck oh no no yeah, I I can't read. <laughs> You're here I get it. to slay her. It's funny. It's funny. You make your way a warning, she will not ignore. Alright. I'm gonna do like the the interior of the cat. Okay, now what we're doing here? The blade. You just need to go kill her like right away. A door. Good. She focus. And there you are. You step. Oh, I'm from. So you lunge. You feel flat. This is. Do you? It's like. Yeah, but it. it yes. Exactly. It's over. With your. You open the cabin door. What's done? I do. But the blade. Thank you. A warning. She will. She. The interior of the cabin is cold. A soft odor of dirt permeating the air. Cobwebs flutter in the corners. 
You can hear wind whistling outside, banging the shutters against the windows. The only furniture of note is an elegant antique table with a pristine blade perched on the edge. I'm just reading things. Yeah, we happy. No happy. <laughs> uh, okay. We need to not. No, yeah, no. We need to take the blade. Then let her possess us. And then slay her once she does. It feels like no one's been like I've been saying. That's it. Right. The door to the basement groaned. I see you brought that annoying. We could always try violence. It's worked for us so far. Violence is fun. She's a ghost. Who says ghosts are immune to violence? Common sense? <laughs> There's nothing common or sensible about common sense. Action and observation are the only things that matter. Hmm. Fine. Then let me observe that the acts of killing her and killing ourselves haven't got us much of anywhere. We're still back in this cabin, we're still dealing with her, only now she has a good reason to hate us. <laughs> I suppose you have a point. Do you have any ideas then? We could always ask her what she wants. Yeah, what do you... What do you want for Krampus? Oh, for the love of... Don't do that. Whatever she wants, it will end the world. And is that really so bad? Yes. It is by its very definition, <laughs> bad. But those are the only options, aren't they? Violence or doing what she wants. Or just leaving her down here. Though ignoring a problem is rarely a solution. Is it? No, uh, he's got a point. Uh, oh, I shouldn't have done that. Too little, too late. But you can, you still, can still make things right. right. She's not in a position to bargain. Trying to at least get the new dialogue. You don't we have haven't to gotten do anything that. you don't want to. We don't have to do anything, but maybe we should. We did kill her. Wouldn't it be the moral thing to help her now that we have another chance? When a hero slays We're a monster, doing that. does he apologize to it? No. So don't try to make things right. She was going to end the world. You didn't do anything wrong. Aside from, apparently, killing yourself. And that doesn't have much to do with her. Eh. You know. You know why... So many fucking options. There's so many goddamn options. I like, yeah, what happened? Why am I different? Why are you different? You don't look dead, killer. The princess grabs your wrist, a sudden shock of cold uh. flowing all the way up your arm, uh. her eyes still fixed on yours as you try to squirm out of her grip. Eh. And you don't, you don't feel, feel dead, dead either. She lets go and pulls away. Your fingertips tingle painfully as the chill subsides. Uh. I'm less interested in why you are, or how you are, and a lot more interested in what you are. Yes? I've tried to leave on my own. Before you came back to me, I explored every inch of this place, if even the spaces between the walls. But I never found a way out. I always wound up right back here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I just want to go home. I'm so cold and alone here. Same. But you can come and go as you please. Can't after all. You are absolutely not. Is she? She is. Would she be able to? Now is. All right. Cool. The princess swims through the air in front of you, pausing for a brief. You're really not trying to make it up to me. What do you see? She rushes. I'm not enough. You can't. Your eyes. So this is what it's. So. Hey. It's um. Can you? No. I'm. 
Mm -hmm. You're the back mm -hmm. obviously. I'm <laughs> Make a save. Die. Isn't that an interesting idea? Yes. Inside you with consent. I. And now I'm going to revoke it. It as an option. Slaying her would slay you. Are you sure you're willing to do that? <sighs> Content. Of course we're sure. The decision has already been made. I hit the button! Alright then. Better this than ferrying her out of here. After all that, you're really just going to stab me again? Yeah, it's funny. Hear that? <laughs> She's scared. No point wasting more time. Do it. Do it. You kill it yourself and thus kill her because guts. she is inside Pain you. spreads Ooh. quickly through your torso as you attempt to turn its edge up towards your heart. <sighs> the princess, her spirit bound to your prison of flesh as she had once been bound to the basement's prison of stone, cries out in agony as you slice through organ and muscle. Nice! I don't want to die in you. I thought you finally understood me, but instead you just wanted to hurt me again. I'm a terrible person. Your skin roils and oh. bucks as she violently pushes against it from the inside. Bits of her seep through, white and glowing with ethereal light, but still the walls of your prison hold. If only I could drag you with me and make you understand. But that's not the way things get to go for me, is it? Yeah, apparently not. It would certainly be interesting. Though being dead does sound dull. And you are about to be dead. Again. Yes. Get away from me, you cold little freak. What? Take on the extra spirit and destroy it the only way you can. You feel a dull tear like strips of meat being delicately peeled from bone, but it doesn't matter how delicate your hand hands if you are the meat. You're stripped away from yourself or stripped away from something that used to be you or stripped away from something that used to be important. At the very least, you have been stripped away from something. I always hard to forget at first, then you forget the pain. You were so close, close to leaving and now look, look at you. Look, look at me. me. Is, Is this, this what, what you wanted? wanted? Yes. The words came from both inside and outside of your head before you on the ground as a writhing mass of flesh and scales and feathers. Is that me? Is that what I look like? Oh, you're here too. Apparently. Maybe trying to slay me was for the best. It means you could leave those other voices behind. The two mean ones, at least. I feel kind of bad for the nice one. Mm. But we probably shouldn't think about them too much right now. They're a mess, and I don't think we could fix them. No point in worrying over messes that can't be fixed. Hmm. Gurgling liquid bubbles up from the open pockets and the disintegrating mass in front of you. It is trying to speak, but it no longer has the tissue that uh, speech requires. Wait, if we need to leave together to get out, this this could still count. We have to try before your um, body stops being alive. You know, the cat in the world is. They're not going. To... Hmm. Not the body. What about me? There's nothing we can do for it now, but we can still try to save us. We just have to leave. You are seated in a room that is empty. A chain digs into your wrist, binding one arm to the wall. It is quiet. You are alone. This is what you deserve. 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 Oh, Princess POV. Are you still there? Am I alone again? Hmm. I'm still here. Then at least I won't be lonely. It's nice to hear your voice. I mean, think your voice? It's, it's, it sure is something. Not mad at me, are you? I don't know why you did what you did. But it's hard to be mad when you're just as stuck as I am. We're like prisoners in, together in this, I guess. Different, your whole mood is different mood i'm just trying to make the best of things you could always make the best of things too if you want we both have a chance to start over uh-huh 
Besides, there's something about you being in here with me that feels... Right. I never wanted to be your enemy. Yeah, and I tried killing you again. I don't know what to say. I just feel fine right now. I think things happen for a reason. And if you trying to kill both of us is what it takes for you to finally see what I see, then I'm okay with that. It's about the the destination, not the journey. Even if the murdy the the murdy the the journey involves a big heckin' murder multiple times. <laughs> I'm supposed to get out of here. If we're both here, then what happened to the others? We're still a ghost? Patient's hand solid, then translucent, then solid again. Maybe? It's like sometimes we are and sometimes we aren't. Hmm. Like we're something in between ghost and not ghost. Spooky. Uh, sorry, I stabbed us. That's okay. I'm sure you had your reasons. I don't think it's good to hold on to the past like that anyways. It's better if we choose to move forward together. Together. Let's just get out of here. I wish I knew, but I think we're probably stuck here until something happens. Hmm. If we're both here, then what happened to the others? I don't know. I hope they're okay. <laughs> uh... Some of them, at least. Yeah, you know. I didn't like the one that kept bossing you around. And that quiet one kind of gave me the creeps. He's a bit cold, isn't he? I liked that last one, though. He was nice. I hope he's okay. Yeah, he's, he's our hero, boy. He's, he's always the good one. What's to do? Just wait for something to happen? Well, that's what I've always done. Fair. Must be something for us to do other than wait. I already told you I don't have any ideas. I did tell you that, right? Uh, sorry if I didn't. What happens to us? What happens? What happened to everything? I think you died, or the body on the floor died. Sorry. Hmm. This is what happened to me last time. Tell me first. Um, Wait. you're kind of a broken record right now. Are you okay? I'm a little- I'm not okay, alright, I'm sorry! Tell me sooner than wait. Maybe... Maybe if I stop answering you, you'll say something else. It was like last time I died. Last time I died, I got a title card. I've never gotten a title card. What did yours say? <laughs> a little bit of fourth wall breaking, but you know. First one I got was chapter one, the hero and the princess, and then after we both died, I got chapter two, the specter. <laughs> well, the first one is sweet. All right, all right, get your last out. I'm still a hero. I've been trying to save the world, you know? A villain to one person might be a hero to others. Well, maybe you're just misguided. And the story's not over yet. We might still find a happy ending. But I think it's time we start a new chapter. Hmm, how about... Yes. Chapter 3. The Princess and the Dragon. Aha! Ooh, reversing the order. I like it. Uh, cast yourself as the main character. I see. Very humble. The Princess and the Dragon. I thought I was maybe some sort of bird. I, th I thought I was a bird. I thought I was a bird. Well, they're similar, right? I mean... Technically, kind of. The glass and creaking hinges muffled something is here. I guess you made it back here. Oh no. Oh no! Gaze yeah, turns back to your hands, they flicker once we're again. We're all wrong. It's like you don't really know what we're supposed to be. Hmm. Oh boy. The thumb of the floorboards above, then another. The scraping of metal against the surface, the flickering in your body stops. You are solid. I know that sound. That's the knife. 
I guess it's hard to do anything without it. Enjoying the new mystery anime game, so many chess school. Not anytime soon. I have it on my wish list, I'm pretty sure. But we got we got oh infinite wealth to get into uh after this. So that's gonna be like a whole thing. So it's a Christmas game because every Yakuza game is a Christmas game. You're like a dragon, lad, whatever. Three hinges once again, but this time you clear closer. So what do I look like? Scary. It's hard to describe. It's hard to look at you. Oh. Movement on the stairs. Thumb. 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 Word. Why is it, why are we so big? I figure marriage is shrouded in a feathered darkness, the world trailing behind it, its shining blade gleaming against the wooden walls that stares at you with wild, hollow eyes. What the hell am I? You're you? You've always looked like this. You're scary sometimes, but looks only matter so much. Mm. What do you want to do? I guess we'll just have to talk to them. Yes. So, here we are again. I'm back in chains and you have your knife. So, what are we going to do? The head on the figure cocks the side. It is inquisitive, suspicious, hostile. Its emotions are unreadable. I guess we could just... stare at each other? The silence holds. The quiet is because I'm not there? No, I don't think so. You've always been a little quiet. Yeah. I Talking to people can't is hard. What's going on in there anymore now that I'm back in my own body? Do you want to share your thoughts? It, it'd only be polite, really. Oh, you would like to hear what we're thinking, wouldn't you? Ah. Oh. He raises the blade above his head, dangling it by the hand in front of his eyes. But I think we hold the power right now. As the figure continues to stare with a wild grin, but does not act. How dull. We've already had our discussions in private. I'd rather not keep listening to the rest of you run in circles, repeating the same arguments again and again and again. It was so much more interesting when we had someone to mediate. God, I really, I really like this one. This, God, this one might be my favorite. I just, I love like the different POV and now like these guys are now just talking through their body entirely. Whatever. It's weird. I'm sorry. Did you just share privileged information with the enemy? Well, it isn't privileged anymore. Now is it? Do we really need all this secrecy? Hmm. No, we don't. Uh, yes we do. Sidebar everyone, now. Chop chop. Hello, I can't observe her. Hopefully you're doing good. By the way, we're going through our last fucking run through a Slay the Princess and we're Fucking got reverse POV right now, which is kind of really fucking cool. It's very fucking cool. Play it some old fucking metaphor, I see. Motherfucker. I see you. Doing that. Fantasy pers- ah. Fantasy persanga. If you will. Very- very cool. Very, very proud of you. We got swallowed by a worm today. That's a thing. A worm. How do you get swallow, swallowed by a worm? Why? Why would you let that happen to you? Was it a purple worm? I hope. I hope it was a purple worm. <laughs> it's funny. That's a D and D reference. Um. 
Sometimes the mind in the mind in front of you falls back into itself. Um. There's no response. Um. Excuse me. Nothing. They're not listening to me. <laughs> They're not listening to me. Uh, I think I'll have to make them listen. Try to be a, try being assertive. You're right. No more nice princess for them. I'm going to speak my mind. That's right. Uh, hello? Silence. I'm trying to say something. Silence again. Hey, I said I'm talking now. Will you listen to me? Ooh, ooh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, girl boss. Kind of purple. And he had a human face, too. He had a human face? Oh, that's disgusting. So you are. And very loudly. Do you have something to say? Oops. I mean, yeah. <sighs> I already know about all that privileged information because he's in here with me. Oh, how very interesting. Yeah. Yeah, that changes things, doesn't it? A bit. Doesn't it? Oh, it changes things all right. We get to take out two birds with one stone. That's the fucking bird. Wait, what? From what I remember, it's pretty easy to kill you the first time around. And this time you're back to being very... What's the word? Fleshy. <laughs> yes, exactly. That's precisely the word I was looking for. You're fleshy now. No more of that incorporeality. Trust me, I wouldn't be doing this if I didn't think it would be easy. And are you doing this? Are you? Oh, I most definitely am. You were kind of came, came an asshole, didn't you? You feel small as the monster in front of you attacks, blade rays and wings spreading. Uh, before anything happens, I just wanted to let you all know that we are not all on board with this. Or no, is that here? I'm trying to like the, the coloring. Now, now, we voted. Voted. It was not a majority decision. But we did have a plurality. The fuck does that mean? He shouldn't count. Damn. Says who? Says me. He's not one of us. He's been here since the beginning. The old chum really deserves to say. Besides, You'll all thank us when this is finally over and we are officially on top. But enough chatter. Oh, so you've finally decided to do something, have you? Hmm. Silence just a moment as cold eyes regard you. And sounds still as soft eyes hesitate. With a sharp sting of cold metal sliding deep into your chest, but you can feel something else too. Yeah, as your legs wobble and then Princess as... collapses against the wall. Oh! See? That was easy! It was too easy. It felt bad. Don't feel bad. Life is all about taking the easy wins. You don't think the people at the top got there because they worked for it, do you? I mean, of course they did. Hard work is important. Hard work pays off. Yeah, hard work often goes unappreciated. Why bother? Yeah, screw hard work. I guarantee you that anyone who's anyone. Why did we go back? To take shortcuts. Am I supposed to find that impressive? Oh, so you guys are terrible at this. You didn't even you didn't go, you didn't even go go for the heart. Of course you are. I got us here, didn't I? Yes, yes. Everyone's very impressed with your accomplishments. But in case you hadn't noticed, she isn't dead yet. So how about you finish this before you start celebrating yourself? What are you waiting for? You won, didn't you? Not that it's hard executing a helpless captive. Oh, hey, I'm back in my body. Oh, you're different. Hi. You're back! Yeah! Just as I you intended. fucking assholes! I was never cut out for leadership, really. Oh my god. You're right. It's quiet again. 
Are you still going to kill me? Ooh, should we? It would be so easy. Absolutely. Nothing of substance has changed. She remains a threat to the entire world. I'm obviously not going to kill you. Then the only thing left to do is cut me out of here. You should give the knife to me, though. What if you using it kicks you out of your body again? Okay, listen. I know you're in charge again, but this is obviously a trick. We can't trust her. We literally just stabbed her. Someone's gonna have to take a leap of faith eventually. Okay, problem is I just fucked this up. We need we do need to go back here. No, we need to go back here. But we'll do that in a second. Uh let's get uh, You go to cut the princess from her bindings. And as the blade slices into her wrist... You'll pull back across the threshold. Oh, I... felt that. You're back. Menace paramates the hollow eyes in front of oh, you. Oh no, you're back. Yeah. Sorry, girly. But we're seeing this through. The monster in front of you pulls the blade back and drives it into your heart. You're torn between two places. Don't leave me. You are power, you and you, you are weakness, you are hope and you are despair, you are acceptance and you are rejection. You are the canvas and you are the painter. You are the victim and you are the victimizer, you are the life and you are death. You, the hero and the princess, the princess and the dragon. Let us die here. Slam the door in your own Don't face. Don't let everything die here. You have to end this. His words are empty, hollow, echoes the raving of a ghost. Please. He's already gone, all the threads tie themselves together into a loop that does not end. We're back together again. Together. Your hands tattered and stained in memories. Maybe. Why were we fighting each other? I don't know. We needed something to do. Then I guess we need something to do again. To new beginnings! Yeah! You're a difference! Yes, so actually. Cold. It shouldn't feel like this. It didn't before. Damn. The peace does not last, nor can never it's time to leave. The memory turns. Where does she go? Should we try and find her? Princess and the dragon and the dragon. Is that a... This... If they ignore them. Let's see what she says about this one. What it looks like. Flickering lights in empty cityscapes. Whenever you are... This one is perspectives bleeding into one. You know her better than you know yourself. She will make for an empathetic heart. Do not mourn her, for you would not mourn yourself. Damn. My oh, I know I need to... Just in case... I will walk. We will meet again. Share the stenciled heart before bringing it to her. But the heart held in the Okay. Okay, so we need, to, we, need, we need to actually go back. Isn't that an interesting... Oh. You 
were here. I thought I was going to be alone again. I didn't Trying to get some new dialogue while we're going back. I'm happy I only seem to have brought you. Uh, that's not nice of me to say. They weren't all bad, but they were definitely mostly bad. Maybe this means things between us can get better. Maybe everything that went wrong just came from them. I hope. Because I really wouldn't like to be stabbed a third time. You don't say. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Deep breath, princess. Let's go. Let's go. Close the cabin stairs, but it seems slow down the closer you get in a moment. You're halfway there. In two moments, you're halfway there again. Having distance and having... Having the distance until the upstairs feel almost within reach. We're not going to make it, are we? We're going to be stuck again. We're... Yes, correct. Then at least I won't be alone. I don't know. I'm just... Thank you. This is what I wish I That's okay. I don't know. Get all these. Well, that's I already Waiting has always worked for me before, but nothing's still happening. Maybe we just have to wait some more. Maybe. <sighs> you have to keep picking the same option over there. <laughs> okay, there we go. I got another achievement. All right, cool. Uh, it's not a title card. We haven't seen a title card. You've gotten title cards? What did they say? No, that's stupid. You're going to laugh. No, I won't. I promise. <laughs> I want to know what it's like to be you. Oh, to be me. It's also like uh, the version of her where she's like harsh. The harsh version of her. didn't turn out so violent. Mm. But that doesn't mean that things can't get better from here. Doesn't seem very clear in how you get the like, don't slay Greg then you slay later but whatever. I think we need a new title card, though. How about... Chapter 3. The Princess and the Dragon. Oh, boy, Senora, I like it. Thanks. I thought it would be fun. Wham. Look at the princess. Princess head, you gotta get me out of here. Say Are you trying to say something out loud? I don't think you can do that while you're in here with me. Okay, well now we know that. <laughs> I think we're stuck together, so we have to be on the same team. I hoped you were on my side by now. Oh, I was freaking out. Thumb. Quick, tell them I'm here. Okay, let's see what happens. I'm not alone here this time. Part of you stayed with me when we split apart. Last dance, emotions are unreadable. You don't want to hurt that part of you, do you? Silence holds. 
stuff in there? That always happened in real time. Is that why you're always quietly staring? Yes. I can't hear what's going on in there anymore now that I'm back in my own body. Do you want to share your thoughts? It, it'd only be polite, really. Oh, you would like to hear what we're thinking. She knows about the, the side of being gone. That would be weird. A weird bluff to come up if it weren't true. Look, I love that you're trying to contribute, but I think we need to take a little side bar. But I don't want to do it. I'm so sorry. This will just be a moment. Sounds of the mind. Oh no, it's like the the orange one's supposed to be the narrator. Was a mind from you? Well, okay. Mm. I guess we wait for an answer. Rude, though. Yeah, but I guess there isn't much we can do about it. So you wait. My apologies. They're really being quite dull in here. Hmm. And wait. We're not being dull. We're strategizing. Now, if you would all just bear with me. You know, it's just like sometimes it's like hard to tell because it's it it's all the same voice actor for all the voices. So I just gotta I gotta like it. Think about like the tone and everything and how they're talking. And decision made. Wow, what's your decision? I hope it's a good one. Good for us, not for you. But we get to take out two birds with one stone. From what I remember, it's pretty easy to kill you the first time around. And this time you're back. Around leave. You're back, just as I intended. I was never cut out for leadership, really. And that's a brilliant plan. Whoever needed violence, anyway. Inaction is still a choice. If you turn around and leave, you're damning everyone to death. Fuck em. But we're not damning ourselves. You're part of everyone. Are we now? That must be you in that body again, but... You're just turning around and leaving? What about me? What am I supposed to do here? I don't cry about it. She sounds so sad. Say nothing. This is not a resolution. I don't know. It kind of feels like it is. Yeah, we got our decider back. And we didn't die. I feel on top of the world right now. You're not even going to answer me. What did I ever do to deserve you? Nothing. Yeah. It's so cold and empty here. Okay, so that's a harsh one right there. There we go. Look over your shoulder, do not find her, nor will you ever. It's time to leave. Memory gone. returns. Where did she go? Leave the shared she heart to languish. Her? And is that a. <laughs> Flickering lights and empty cityscapes become pockets he is of different vitality here. and movement. I am more than I was before. Whenever you what is your thoughts? This one is perspectives. Do not mourn her, for you would not mourn yourself. Okay, she looks different. Uh, I'm gonna go back. I await your return. We will meet again. Get the princess in beating heart before bringing it to her an empathetic heart. You're on a path in the world. You're here. Neat. Okay, now we got to figure out the raises like an easy. Tower, the apothesis. I think we might need to go for tower. Usually got the fury every time. 
I believe. Okay. So, okay, yeah. so we're going for tower. I don't think we got that one. Yay, God Princess Time. Yay! Big lady. Very large. You make all she put No, actually, hold on. Let me double check. Double check. I'll just go check on, um... Check, uh, memories. Which one? Oh, wait, no, I just quit the game. Fucking! I'm so smart. I'm so smart! Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, I'm very smart. Just, just, just give me, just give me a second. Just, gi just, give, just give me a second. <laughs> it's a drag to exercise. Another is to exercise oneself. As I am a harsh companion. Leave with a harsh companion. Leave with a gentle companion. I guess there's versions of this where we. Welcome back! I'm so disappointed in you. Yay! Uh... Fantastic. Fail to disarm a harsh companion. the vine it is very hard to kill a god how can you kill a god Just making sure okay okay yeah, I, just, I, I wanted to double make sure we haven't we haven't gotten it uh right so tower Take, take the blade. Go to the basement. The door to the basement creak per pitch. Don't let. Good. She focus. And there you are. Are you here? You step. Oh, I'm from. So. She you go into this expecting to die. You're going to die. Hesitating. Why don't you drop the knife and the two of us can be civilized with each other? <sighs> Thank you. Maybe now- Against will be fine. I don't know what you're hoping to accomplish. So here we are. What an awkward start to a rel- Oh. You You charge the princess. She can't. We shouldn't have. But she doesn't stop as you lie. Crushed and broken. You shouldn't have let that. Is this really the. She applies. This is. I'm a. Everything. Your honor. Right, you're here. Tower. Feed. A warning. Before you go any further. So basically. Um, you're going to do what we did rest. the first time we did. We went through this. But we're going to the not blade. take the blade and defy. Basically. No blade this time. Blade, no blade. Making your way down the spiral staircase is a time-consuming and no. But the words don't leave your mouth. Instead, your legs buckle and your knees hit the floor. That's my good little bird. Now, why don't we talk? The last time we met, what draws you? Do you think holding shut your beak is enough to stop me from prying it open? Do you think your skull can save your thoughts from being seen? Yes. Can... can she do that? There's nothing she can't do. Confused. Meek. 
A chorus of submissive indecision. Is that why you came to me unarmed? Maybe. It doesn't matter. All of it is easily brushed aside. And there it is. I am destined to end the world. Something about that thought wraps itself around my heart. It feels like a fundamental truth to my being that I'd somehow forgotten. Hmm. The collapse of the old is a necessary prelude to the birth of the new. And the world as it is now is overdue for... alterations. Yeah? It's time for me to seize my destiny. And you, little bird, will help me seize it. That's nice. She's inevitable. I don't agree. There's nothing else for us to do but help her. Maybe she'll be nice to us. She will not. What happened to you after I died? Know the limits of your privilege, little bird. There is an empty place at my side for you to fill. If you'll have all you have. Don't be rude. Of course. This is mm. weird. Your will was so easily. There's nothing to be sorry about. This is how it was always going to be. And it is good. All right, I'm done with this. I have to do it this. the other way. I'm just going to go sit the in the blade corner. Blade is needed. Let me know no, if we get there's two back. ways to get it. You get the apostasis with the contrarian or the paranoid. I'm going to do paranoid. Oh, well. Wouldn't let me. You, you poor, wretched, wretched little thing. thing. You already do believe. I guess we'll see all the new dialogue. You always believed. Just, I wasn't getting the options I needed, which is weird. The last door to your heart. It's easy. And once you let her in, you'll be safe and free forever. Please. Her My chains shatter. What a good disciple you are. Yeah, we're getting to that, so. Beep. You take the. Alright, try again. Good. You're still listening to reason. You stay. <sighs> the blade tumble. We don't know. So here we are. What an awkward. Oh. You know. Doubt on. Give up. Are you s Is that You take Sir The door to the basement creaks open, revealing a spiral staircase. It steps almost as deep as you are tall. The smell of incense drifts up from below. Can you take 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 the blade, obey? Mm. And slips. The blade slips from your fingers and clatters uselessly to the floor. We didn't have to do that, and yet you did. She's so much more than us. You wouldn't understand what it feels like to be in her presence. Oh, I understand what's going on, and you'd better snap yourself out of it. Neil. No. But the words don't leave your mouth. You will just do it already. It will feel so much better to do as she says. Said no. Such firm resistance. How surprising. Perhaps you need another lesson in submitting to your betters. Okay, here we go. Pick up. You reach forward. You can feel a creep. Oh, we'll end. 
No, you can't just slay yourself. You're perfectly healthy and capable. <laughs> and all you have to do is ignore her and do what has to be done. Nah, I give up. The blade and the hand man. that wields it remain firmly locked in place until you change your mind and decide to do literally anything else. Look at you quaking against my will. An ant defying a god. It's pointless to resist. In the end, everything submits to oblivion. But you're not the one resisting me, are you? There's something else in there. Right, can you help me with that? <laughs> Is that a person? No, it used to be a person. It's something different now. An echo. Is... Is she talking about you? Yeah. That's impossible. She's not supposed to be able to interact with me. She... You're a small one, aren't you? Very small. A shriveling little worm stretched beyond its a limits. Worm. Trying to control things that it can't understand. No, no, no. What are you talking about? I'm just... I don't care what you are. You're mine. You bring the blade to your neck. You slice through soft flesh, severing veins and arteries, your blood flowing freely down your body. It's a painful lesson in obedience, but the pain won't last forever. No, 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 no. When I see you again, you'll free me from my chains and deliver me to the destiny that lies beyond this place. Mm-hmm. We will. I promise. Oh. I know you will. Oh. Everything, Everything goes dark, dark, and you die. All right. Apothesis. Apothesis. You're on a path in the woods, and at the end of that path, Oh, let me guess, and at the end of the path is a cabin! Wow! Imagine, we can actually see it at the first thing. A couple things here. I'm seeing, seeing the different routes here. Okay, I think I know. I think I, I think I know what I'm locking into, as it were. Excuse me? Come on, man. We can see it right in front of us. And besides, we've been here like, what, five times already? That's, that's incorrect. I think this is three. Can't even fucking count. Who cares? The woods are always the worst part anyway. Nothing ever happens in them. Well, you don't know that. I care. Every single time you've been here, it means an entire other reality has been damned to oblivion. One reality is already an incalculable loss. And there is a massive difference between three and five. Oh, it's not that. It's only like two more fingers than three. Feels like the numbers getting thrown around here are too big not to be abstract. Numbers like five. Numbers like entire realities. At the end of the day, it's all just silly, isn't it? Yeah, I'm numbers are silly. To a whole reality, and he's asking us to think about the difference between three and five. <sighs> You're already starting to lose the thread. Just because you oh can't personally sum up the contents of an entire reality doesn't mean that the people inhabiting it don't contain moral value. If you have any sense of ethics left in there, if you have any moral compass, please, you have to stop her. All right. Don't you get it? Might makes right, and she didn't even have to touch us last time to prove her power. That's true, actually. So what? Just because she made us kill ourselves, we're supposed to submit to her authority without question? Yes. I knew <laughs> when to surrender to our better. You would have lost eventually anyway, and it would only have made her angry. It would only have made things worse for all of us. 
Oh, for the love of... Can you all please just get on with it? <laughs> You're not making this any easier for yourselves. Do we even have agency right now? We either do what she wants, or we do what he wants. Either way, we're listening to somebody. He's got a point, you know. Please, nothing in life is a binary. Obviously, we find a third choice that nobody wants. Ha <laughs> Yes! The one that everyone hates. Perfect. You all talk about choices and freedom, but there is no choice when it comes to the will of a god. I'm going to cut you off right there. She is not a god, and the more times you fail, the harder it becomes for you to succeed. But the fact that you're still here means you still have a chance to pull this off. So, princess, dangerous, cabin, slay, now. Thank you for putting it in simple words for me. Okay, so hold on. I have so many questions. I'm not going to count as this. What am I? As you finish your inane question, the ground quakes beneath your feet. Uh -oh. You feel an unyielding force uh -oh. pull at you and your surroundings. The trees start to sway and then crumble, breaking apart as everything is drawn towards the cabin. Even the earth beneath you seems to shift, your feet unable to grip solid ground as you're dragged forward along with everything else. <laughs> uh the end of everything. The beginning of something new. The moment we open that door, she will be free. Any, uh, words of warning? You already know everything you need to know. Proceed. As you step forward, ah! the cabin explodes. Holy shit! You're flung backwards. Jesus! Slam into a tree as debris rains Fuck! down on you. Witness your betters ascension. Jesus Christ! You watch Massive the lady. Awe and terror as the princess emerges, her body unfurling from some vast space as she stands upright to face you. Hey, slow, slow, slow. Large. The world bows to her. The ruined landscape shifts, trees and stone and the ground itself succumbing to her gravity orbiting her like a great black hole. Wow. Finally, the little bird has set me free. This is always how it was going to end. And this is always how it was going to begin. Right. There's a loud thunk from the tree behind you as something embeds in its shattered bark. Your pristine blade. It's now or never. Hey, funny one. Didn't you say something about a third option later? One that would make everyone unhappy? Better say before I choose that guy. I, I, I'm kind of curious. Well, we could always run away, right? Oh, uh, yeah. To where? Uh. I don't know. Anywhere. Anyway. You're all ruining the moment of her ascension. Have you no respect for the divine? Oh, my God. I'm, I, I'm so curious. Cowed to your core, you turn to <laughs> leaping from the piece of floating debris and into the empty space beyond where the woods used to be. <laughs> this isn't cowardice. This is a calculated move. Exactly. Sure it is. Can it be a bit of both? I'd be lying if I said I wasn't just a little afraid of her. Eh. Are you so awestruck by my glory that you cannot bear to look at me? I think not. No, don't do it. As you fall, a great force pulls at the back of your neck, violently yanking you away from whatever lack of destination you were headed towards. Now witness me! Bear witness! Yes, your grace. She turns you to face her. Aye. The scruff of your neck is held firmly between two giant fingers. That two fingers. So much for running away. I forgive you your transgressions, but my destiny is inescapable. Hey. She's I right. Guess. We don't even have a weapon. It's over, isn't it? 
And yet she still extends her mercy. We should do as she says. Why are you all resisting in the first place? Emb okay, embrace. So much for spiting her. Spiting him it is. Good. I can feel your heart opening to mine. Her words are like a gentle tug, drawing you closer to the mountain of her body. Ah. Uh. You land softly on her shoulder. Ah. Her skin is warm and comforting. This really is the end. Is it the end? We're still here. Let's go and weaves into an unchecked nothingness. He does not respond. Everything is gone but us and her. This is her power. This is where we're meant to be. He's really gone. Hmm. Huh, that's unexpected. But he would have said something by now if he were still here. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Never knew when to shut up, that one. It's part of why I liked him so much. I can't believe all it took to make him disappear was saying no once. The power of saying and no. Wait, it's, it's very powerful. What happens now? This world is but an illusion keeping us from my ascension. A play of shadows dancing on the wall. Princess reaches forward to the untextured nothing and buries her fingers in its divine flesh. Her touch is soft. The flame may be snuffed. But the wall remains. This isn't just for my glory. You are a part of this now. Squawk! See? This is nice. We're safe. She's helping us. She's helping everyone. Hmm. The grip times and somehow you feel that the pain sits at the limits of your comprehension like an endless sea of hands. Falling on you one after one after a, a, one after another after another before finally collapsing on themselves, you lose yourself in the darkness. You're hurting me. It will be over soon, little bird. And then your eyes will open. And all of this pain will seem but the fading memory of a distant dream. Soon? Soon? Does that mean there's gonna be more? There better not be more. My only comfort is that he isn't here to see us suffer. He would love that, wouldn't he? Oh yes, he would. There's nothing is ripped open and with it you are ripped open amid a sea of just cognitive pain you can feel everything that is you pouring out into the ether and you feel something else to anger I need to lash out and hurt that which is hurting yes. you hurt her do something anything to make it stop make it stop no if suffering is what she demands of us suffering is what will give why would I doubt our God it is so so tempting to see what's on the other side of that great big nothing but I think I'm gonna lose myself if this goes on for much longer why do we have to be the ones going through all this pain while she gets all the benefits uh. blasphemer we have been given the gift of offering ourselves to a higher purpose and you spit in its face Make her suffer with you. You're a weave of tendrils racing against themselves and down the shape of an arm. You snap around it. Ah! Relief as a massive burden is lifted from you. You are in one, one piece. You are in your body. Your eyes open before you as the massive form of a princess. Arms barely texture nothing behind her. A hole in the world leading into something beyond something beautiful. I knew it! That old windbag was hiding all kinds of secrets from us. There's a whole world out there! Crazy, huh? I don't know what to say. It's just so beautiful. Doesn't the mere sight make all the misery worth it? Eh, it's not all that. 
Eh. What did you do to me? I was supposed to be perfect. I was supposed to be a god. I was all of those things. And now I'm not. All because of you. Yeah. Sorry about that. Except with a futile star, that's something beautiful that sits beyond. We could have had everything. If only you had given me a little more, we could have been free on the wings of my glory. Now we're stuck here. Forever. I, for one, am perfectly happy to be stuck here forever. It's more than worth it if that's the price we paid for taking her down a peg. Coleman shudders it closes, the tendrils lose their grip, freeing the princess as they retreat. It's gone. No. No, how do we get it back? Can we try again? We'll suffer so much better if we get to try again, I, I promise. I'm very interested to see what the other thing is. We're probably gonna go so back and see it. Here. If this wasn't enough, then what is? That's a lot of Ains. The opportunity to try again, or you ever it's time to leave. Memory She's returns. Gone. Where does she Into go? Become shackled to a Should divine we try being. Should find her? And is that a mirror? Why is it here? Why? This. Yeah. Bleh, bleh, bleh. bleh. Head. I am a growing chorus of contradiction. A mass of all of me is. What do you think of this vessel? This one sits at the cusp of awakening. A new god waiting to be born. She will make for a terrifying and divine heart. Yeah, I'll say. Do not mourn her, for she has finally found her light. Alright, cool. Let's go back. I will be here when it is time for us to meet again. Everything goes dark and you die. Bring the apothesis to her terrifying divine heart. Your honor, you're here. Uh, right, let me load. I'm just very curious what this is. Suffer in silence. It will be over soon, little bird. Then you're all soon. My yeah. Suffer from the darkness alone. The most important piece of yourself. Memories of your entire lifetimes lived fade away into a space where only your recollection of them is something you used to be, used to be there. You die and are reborn, die and reborn, shrinking and shrinking again until there is no you left to die or shrink. You've done so well, little bird. Behold the fruit of your anguish. Behold! As open are they yours, they don't feel like yours anymore, but there is no other word to describe what they belong to. Uh, where are we? Does it even matter? Here, there, it's all the same. You're all starting to sound like me. Hmm. Vision focuses, revealing what has been done. The world has opened up and beyond is something beautiful. Oh. What? What is that? I think I want to be there. It's where we're supposed to be. Can we come back if we go there? I don't want to go there if it means we can't come back. Sheesh. The red steps forward, bringing you both to the edge of something beautiful. It is dizzyingly vast. Nine of you cross the threshold. There's a roaring, like, underground thunder. She has stopped in her place. Stopped in Were place. Were we supposed to stop? I don't think this is over. We have to touch grass. After everything I cast aside on my path to ascension, what remnant of the old could possibly be left to defy me? 
He looked down at the prince's feet, writhe, writhe in the shifting mound, a mass of hands clambering over each other, crawling their way up her body. They start to pull. No! The mound becomes a scene. The princess struggles to stay afloat to keep the two of you close to the hole in the world, the light of something beautiful beyond, but she is drowning. As the sea rises, she pulls you up. Oh, pulls you from her shoulder and holds you above the tide. You turn back to look at her. We have to be able to do something to help her. This can't be how it ends. It can't. It can't. It can't. It can't. I have like just the sea of arms just enveloping her. That's, that's, that's fucking... Ugh. I think this is the end. I can feel every part of me freezing over. Hands reach over hands, pulling at her face, dragging her down to the frigid depths. She is tired. Her life fades from her eyes. You have been the only thing I've ever known to show me grace. I am sorry if I have not shown you the same. Uh. The princess summons the last of her strength. Her face is shield of purpose and determination. In her final act, she hurls her toward the hole in the world, toward something beautiful beyond. Fly, little bird. Squawk! No. No. I don't want to be somewhere she isn't. It would always be dark without her. It's what she wants for us. But can we make it? Flap those fucking wings. Of course we can. We can do whatever we want. And I believe in her. Yeah, then it fucking closes. But the whole seals for you can make it to the other side. If there's time to bask what lies beyond, it is not now. Damn. Turn back to look at her. You see that she's gone. It's time to leave the memory. Is that a mirror? Receive grace from a divine Why being. Why now? This yeah. Is there any other? Yeah, no. Okay. Okay, now I have to figure out... Actually. Um, menu. Yeah, of course, killing her is probably a, a thing there. You say it, no? Uh, if you laugh, the moment of clarity. Oh, but that's not a fucking hmm. nightmare. Go go. We'll we'll see. Moment of clarity is one, but it's not. Uh, doesn't lead to a harsh one. If you're kind of trying to go for that, unfortunately. The other one. Damn soul. Gun What am I do? Uh, I feel like this has to be the person that thing. I feel like I feel like maybe we actually only have like one more. 
that one. Which again, it's not a harsh one. We need the we need, we need the harsh. I think I know what I might do. Uh, I'm gonna go down the. I'm gonna go down the damsel route, and we're gonna get the happily ever after. And then... <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I think I think now now we're just going for the. Not this. Uh, all right, damsel. Damsel. Human. Oh, she went on. The. Don't. Mm -hmm. How many times? Wait, really? Come down. You walk down. You're only make. Maybe there. Seed. That doesn't really matter with the blade. The door to the basement creaks open, revealing an intricate stairwell. Rescue her? What are you talking about? Did you forget that she's a world-ending monstrosity? Are you, are you going to going, going to do anything? Yeah, trying to. Despite the complete moral disaster trying that would be, to. you'd have to get her out of those chains. Good luck with that. Yeah, because what I'm probably going to do, once we hit like the last one, I'm probably going to go down the Nightmare one and get the uh, Moment of Clarity one. Uh, it doesn't lead to a harsh one, so we just kind of like do it and then just go back. I'll probably go down the... Uh, the harsh one of like the wraith, maybe. I don't know. Probably. I always do that. Don't you see how dainty her hands are? Oh. You'll be able to slip her out with ease. No, she's a prisoner here. You can't just slip her hand through the chains. If her hand could just slip out of the chains, why hasn't she done it already? Because we've yet to present her with her freedom. Oh, why hasn't we did the damsel one actually? I'm not sure I follow. Would you rather believe me, a passionate heart guided by love and my own good nature, or would you rather believe the devil on your shoulder who tells you what you can and cannot do? I think I'd rather believe in facts. Mm. Ah, so you're one of those empiricists. One of us has to be. Then let me show you a brand new truth. Narrator! We courageously step forward and free our beloved from her bindings. My beloved. No, I can't. You what? I would if not on my... You would. I would. I'd listen to him if I were you. He has a lot of str... <sighs> I can't... I told you... I'm free, and you're not trying to... Let me guess. Spoken with the rank cynicism of... That sounds perfect. The princess takes your hand, the last hopes of the entire world slipping through your fingers as they intertwine with hers. We have each other. We don't need the world for our happy ending. Oh. I like to think that you do, actually. Look, I have my doubts, but the choice has been made and this is happening. You don't have to mope about it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I will mope about it, because moping is the only recourse you love-blind fools have left me with. 
you and the princess walk up the stairs hand in hand. Yay. Ugh, look at the way she's smiling at you. <laughs> she doesn't have to be so happy about this. And what happens after we walk up the stairs? Let's see. Oh, isn't that interesting? The door slams in your face and the lock clicks. That's a familiar move. Hmm. Did I do that last time? Then you should know that you won't be able to leave. Oh no! Did someone lock us in here? That's not fair! We're supposed to leave now. She's right. It isn't fair. But the unfairnesses of the world are no match for the strength of true love. It's true. Enough with this true love nonsense. You just met her! Of course you hmm. wouldn't understand. Our passions run deeper than anything you have ever known. Are you listening to this? You don't have to go along with the every whim of that delusional voice. I'm just along for the ride at this point. You think you can open it? Well, I don't know. Do you think I can? Of course she can. You believe in her, right? I believe! Nobody is leaving this basement. I could do it if we if we try together. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Like a pair of teenagers in love, <laughs> you and the princess place your hands on the door together. Blech. Blech. And the lock clicks. Oh <laughs> well. Get bodied. Oh, are you kidding me? <sighs> I told you our love was insurmountable. Is Smitten just like overrides the narrator entirely? It's so funny. And the blade, that's right. There's still a chance for oh you my to do the God. right thing. Take the blade from the table and slay her before it's too late. You're not doing that. You're enjoying this, aren't you? Yes. You're taking every opportunity you can to draw out the end of the world and make me suffer. I hate you. Good. You know, if her walking out that door is really gonna end the world, can't we all just stay here? Seems like an easy win for everyone. Yes. That's not how this works. Yes, what he said, that's not how this works. Obviously, we have to leave with her. It's our happy ending. Mm. Got a life ticket. What a romantic suggestion! Oh. You're right. We don't need the world. All we need is each other. It's true. That's exactly what That's I just suggested. Stupidly big. Her eyes are romantic. <laughs> when I suggested it. Did you suggest that? I wasn't listening. You answered me. But the door's right there. We can just leave. W wait. Why would she say that? Was she not wooed by our proclamation of love? Uh, are we not enough for her? Uh, it's fine. She's not wooed by you because staying here and building a life together isn't a solution. It isn't anything. It's a non-answer. It can't be done. You don't know that. Trust me, it'll be better for both of us. If we stay, we can be happy here. We just have to want it. But I... I... We would have to be here forever. Yes. I don't know you. I don't know you! This is really what you want, though. Isn't it? Yes. Her eyes dart uncomfortably to the corners of the room. I guess we could do that. She doesn't seem happy about this. Hmm. But she can't be unhappy about staying with us. Can she? Hmm. I don't know. She has a point. She doesn't know us. That's why we get to know each other. No, it has to be him. It has to be this place. If oh, no. we just made these walls more fitting oh, no. for a princess, if we just say the right things, if we just showed her the contents of our heart, she'd be happy here. Oh, okay. As the voice thinks its thought, your hands raise, fingers pointing towards your chest, and then... What? No, you absolutely do not do that. What? Oh, but I do. Are you going to tear out your fucking heart? What? What is he doing? We can't see unless you tell us. TELL US! Are you sure you want to know? 
I suppose I can't stall forever. You plunge your nails into your chest, digging deep, grasping for a handhold. And you find it, your fingers curling around your ribs. Beautiful. Oh no, what are you doing? Are you okay? You can't do that and be okay. No, you'd be, you'd be surprised. Time out. He should not be allowed to do that. He's not the decider. And yet, it's done, isn't it? He's a little fucking unhinged. It will be soon. You yank violently, your bones cracking with wet pops as you pull yourself apart inch by painful inch. <laughs> Your exposed heart, framed by jagged ribs, thumps rhythmically in your raw, bloodied chest. The loosened uh, threads of your body unfurling to cover the surface of the room. Don't mind my sacrifice. It's a fair price to pay to give her everything she doesn't know she wants. Okay, buddy. Oh, I see. You're trying to tell me something. It's beautiful. If you fucking say so. The princess, mesmerized, reaches towards your beating heart and then everything goes dark and we die. Yes. Yes. Happily ever after. You're on a path in the woods. Mate, we're clearly already in the cabin. <laughs> Mate, what the fuck? Excuse me? You're clearly... Oh. Huh. So you are. How do you know about the cabin? I didn't get to the cabin part of my opening monologue yet. Hmm. We've been here before. Well, not here, here, but I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. You knew about the loop in last time. Now, now. He's clearly disorientated. I'm sure all this new info is going to come as quite a shock to him. Best if we're gentle. Yeah. And right on cue, here's the new guy. Welcome! Hey, welcome to the new voice. Hey, right, let's go. We love the new guy. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm just happy to be here. Yeah, I bet you are. Okay, yes, I get it. You've been <laughs> here before. That's terrible. You know that, right? Because the only reason you would have been here before is if you failed in whatever world you'd come from. Meaning you doomed an entire other reality. But I'm sure since you're so well-traveled, you know that, yes? Yes. Well, we know that now, thanks to you. We're all so lucky to be stuck with, uh, working with mm -hmm. someone so well-informed. Yes! You can count on us to do things right from here on out. Oh, uh, yes, of course. I'm going to describe the room now. Okay, buddy. The interior of the cabin is vast and regal. Oh. High arched windows line the walls, their multicolored glass casting kaleidoscopic Ooh. patterns across the stone floor. It's An nice. iron chandelier hangs from the vaulted ceiling, Ooh. its many candles lit Chim. with flickering light, vaguely oh. illuminating the massive room. This is a house fit for royalty. Yeah, this is a fucking princess place, right? Before you, there's... There isn't a blade, is there? Hmm. That's not good. Oh well. Is it mad if the if the blades here? We didn't use it last time and the time before that she used to to kill us. Now that is some fine reasoning. Who cares about the blade? I think you're right. We're better off without it. That's not right. It's ever been important. <sighs> of course, the blade's important. It's your implement. You're going to need it if you want to do this right. And the fact that you're here right now again means that you have not yet done this right but it's not there is it we don't even get the choice so what are we supposed to do i don't actually know i'm sure it'll turn up somewhere it, it has uh -huh. to it's part of the whole structure of this place i think at the very least it's important hey where's uh the voice of the smitten he ha he was here last time but it's not like him to be this quiet yeah he was a bit of a loud one. Where the fuck he? did he go? Is he okay? I don't think he's. I don't think he's good. We're better off without him, if you ask me. One less opinion we have to contend with. Plus, he's the one who got us into this whole mess. True. Is that so? 
Maybe there is hope for you after all. Oh free my from God. the bad influence of your missing friend. Hmm. Around the okay, of course. <laughs> you cross the room, stopping just in front of the door to the basement. The handle is right there. Do feel free to give it a push as soon as you'd like. There is no door. There's a mirror. No, there isn't. Hmm. Now this is tricky. My eyes say there's a mirror, but my brain says there isn't one. Hmm. Look, if you need help, just raise your hand, and I'll guide it where it needs to go. Uh, yes, can I use the bathroom? <laughs> Reach. You reach forward, your hand instinctively wrapping around the handle. It's gone. I'm just glad we can all agree on a shared reality. Mm hmm. And then you push the door open. Marvelous. We can proceed. It would seem that the stairs to the basement don't lead to a basement at all. Yeah. Rather than go up. They're draped in fine carpet, too. One These that feels go up. soft against your feet. Mm -hmm. If the princess lives here, slaying her would probably... Mm. Uh, no, that doesn't work here at all. Yeah, it's nice. This is nice. It's fancy, even. Mm. I have to say, whatever you did in your previous lives, I deeply dislike how much it's thrown me <laughs> off my rhythm. You yeah, brought up your groove, huh? Don't worry about your it, body, boss. Your body, shit-ass. You're doing great. I'm not. But I appreciate the encouragement. Mm-hmm. Well, if all of this has thrown you off your rhythm so much, then maybe we don't have to slay the princess. Maybe not! Maybe not! No, you absolutely do. Just because she lives in a nice house doesn't mean she doesn't pose a direct threat to all of reality. It's in her very nature. Yeah, okay, buddy. Her voice, gentle and warm, with an undercurrent of fatigue, rolls down the stairs. Falling down the stairs? You're home. Dinner's ready. <gasps> oh, I wonder what's for dinner. As much as I desperately want to know what happened last time, we are not going to examine it. The more we think, the worse this gets. Why are you so on edge? This is much nicer than what we're used to. I'd like to have dinner. Mm. Dinner sounds nice. Oh, that's so nice, doesn't it? Gotta say, I'm I would, I, I would like some When have nice dinner. things ever been a problem? That is the problem. This isn't supposed to be nice, and she's supposed to be a prisoner. I need to stop talking. I need to stop talking. Just go upstairs, okay? Yes. Or seat up the stairs. This hall, like the one <gasps> below, Dinner. is grand what and beautiful. Fuck? Torches bathe the room in warm, comforting light, just enough to illuminate the tapestries along every wall, woven with scenes of chivalry and courtship and romance. <laughs> the many cloth eyes are fixed on each other, gazes averted from the long table in the center of the room, the princess seated at its far end. I think I know where Smitten went. Your pristine blade glints in the weak torchlight, hanging from a golden chain around the princess's neck. Ah. Huh. So that's where it is. And the tip is already pointed right at her heart. Hmm. Okay, everything is falling back into place. All you have to do is cross the room, push down a little, and the entire world is saved. That's easy. It's easy. Yeah, that is easy, isn't it? So, where's the rush? You're here. Now we can start being happy together. Why don't you sit down? Wouldn't that be nice? Yes, it would. As the words leave her mouth, the torches flare and a chair swings in from behind, Whoa. knocking your legs out from under you. You're forcibly seated at the head of the table. Isn't that better? It is better. She's right? so far away, though. What is this place? It's our happy ending. Just like you asked for. It's everything we're supposed to have ever wanted. Hmm. What are we supposed to do now? Oh, right, dinner. I totally forgot about it. Oh, you're so forgetful. Oh, it's just so you. <laughs> the flames burn Whoa! bright and a shadow dives across the table. In its wake. It leaves a feast. Oh my god. I don't, we can't eat all that. It's just two people. <laughs> Go ahead and dig in. I'm sure you're hungry. Am I ever? And look at this spread. It's a feast fit for a king. 
Oh. Yeah. And after everything we've been through, we could use a break. Indeed. More than that, we deserve a break. Eat. You begin to feast, and the princess follows suit, her soft smile never fading. The food is more exquisite than you ever could have imagined. You sample countless otherworldly dishes, sauces and bread and hearty stews Ooh. whose tastes dance across Ooh. your tongue. A good shit. You tear at hunks of meat practically melting from the bone, juicy and tender and bursting with flavors you could scarcely begin to describe. Your cup fills itself again and again with a flowery nectar so sweet it tastes like glimmering jewels. Ah, oh, it's a good shot, let's go. This really is perfect. Yeah, it's it? nice, it's nice, isn't it? It is the best meal you've ever had. Oh, fuck yeah. But then it's over. And you're just as hungry as when you began. Ah. Uh. Wasn't that perfect? We should do it again. The shadow washes across the table, clearing and replating. The feast is once again laid before you. That was a lot. The food is good. Again. You tear into golden crispy flesh, dab at the slurry of aromatic sauces on your plate with thick crusted bread, sip your goblet of sparkling gems. But you have done this already. A good meal is still a good meal. And we didn't even have to clear the dishes. I'm happy. I mean, you're fucking right. I had clear. We had clear. Fuck this. That's like 10 out of 10 right there. And then it's over. And you're just as hungry as when you began. You're still hungry too, right? I know this wasn't as good as it was last time, but we just have to do it again. That's all. It'll be perfect if we just do it again. Hmm. So the shadow sweeps over the table, clearing the old and laying out the new. And so you do it again. The meat is fine. The bread is fine. You sample the side dishes and they're fine too. You finish your goblet, the liquid within no longer glimmering on your palate, instead leaving your mouth coated in a tacky film. You put it down and it fills again. You do not drink more. Mm. Well, food is food, isn't it? Can't always be amazing. What matters is that we don't have to make it. Getting other people to do the hard work always improves the taste. <laughs> that's not true, actually. I think a food tastes better when you make it yourself. Yeah, that's just me, though. That's, 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 that's just me, though. Does it? Because it seems like the taste is getting worse. And we haven't had to so much as lift a finger. Was I just realized something? Uh... Why is my chat not updating? I'll just try to do this real quick. Uh, I think I'll just clear it if I do this, but. Oh, uh, where is it? Very weird. Oh, well, at least like any new red messages will show up, but whatever. Regardless of quality, it's over again, and you're just as hungry as when you began. Again. Hmm. No, no, something was wrong that time. But maybe I was just tasting it wrong. It looks just as good as it did the first time. It shouldn't taste like this. Again, the shadow replaces your feast. And again you eat. The meat is greasy. The bread is tough, its crust hurting your jaw as you chew. The grey vegetables are barely worth the effort of picking through. You don't even touch the goblet, its sickly sweet aroma utterly unappealing. As it happens, you eat, eat the same fucking things over and over and over and over and over again. <laughs> I am so tired of eating. Well, it's still free food we didn't have to make, right? Oh, am I kidding? We were eating like kings, and now we're eating like pigs. Hmm. At least you still have the memory of how good it was the first time. Right? I guess. I'm so tired of this. 
As the words leave her mouth, one of the torches on the wall sputters and then goes out entirely. What just happened? D did I do something wrong? Not a fan of whatever just happened. Mm. Uh, I don't want to sit in the dark. Losers sit in the dark. That's right. <laughs> I want to sit in a brightly lit, spacious room where we can see our beautiful, queenly wife. As if in response to the dousing of their brother, the other three torches blaze brighter, their flames licking at the walls. Shit. Anger that goes to stone. What happened? Did you make that torch go out? You did anything wrong, I just... You said something you wanted to say. But it was wrong. I took away a piece of our light. I'm not supposed to do that. I don't want him to be upset with me. Hmm. You said he. Who is he? He's the voice that whispers sweet nothings in my ear. Hmm. I think he made this place for us. Is she talking about a real voice? Like us, but... We're at the head of the table. We should be in charge. Is he more powerful than we are? Might be. Hey, Shadow, don't you have anything to say? The torches flare and the shadow grows for a moment, but you don't receive a response. Giving us the cold shoulder, I say. Asserting his dominance in the power structure. Hmm. Regardless, it would seem that he, if there is a he, isn't something you can talk to. He says his words are just for me, but he wants me to ask, isn't this enough? Isn't this what you wanted him to do? Not really. He says he's tired, and I don't think he'll answer anything else you have to say. This isn't fair. If I could just talk to him for two seconds, I'm sure we could sort this out and figure out a balanced power structure that works better for everyone. But no, he's decided he's above talking to little guys like us, huh? Hey, what are we supposed to do now? Um, I don't know. Maybe we could play a game. What kind of game? Yeah, that's exactly what we should do. The flames roar and the shadow comes dancing what across the, fuck? the table. It leaves behind an intricate game. Its pieces elegant and beautiful and enticing, its simple rules already apparent, even with little explanation. Hmm. We can probably work together to figure this out as we go. That sounds like a lot of fun, right? Guess. Great, we don't even have a rule book. That means we can make up as many rules as we want. And we will. Don't worry, I am excellent at cheating. What? She'll never suspect a thing. What? I don't think it really matters. This all kind of feels like we're just filling time, you know? Isn't that what we're always doing, though? What? You don't want to win? To show our prowess in all avenues and accumulate respect? Wow, you would be hopeless without me. Count your lucky stars I'm here. You and the princess do indeed figure it out as you go. And what a game it is. The tension between turns, the triumphant highs of moves well-placed, and the tragic lows of miscalculations and careless plays. The warmth of trust and the cool texture of deception. And then, the climax, as she places her final piece. Oh, I think we got the rules wrong. Yeah. And so you start over. She only made us start over because we were winning. Time passes. You play the game. You win. I gotta win! Boom! And there you have it. What did I tell you? Am I great at games or am I great at games? Win a game with a hell of a manipulative voice. What the fuck, man? Oh, you won. I guess we can play again. Time passes. You play the game. She wins. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, I won. I guess we can play again. There is a long pause, and the board does not reset. This isn't fun anymore, is it? You don't need me to tell you that it isn't... Oh. Uh. The princess visibly panics as another torch sputters. Wait, 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 wait. Maybe this is just too easy. 
Maybe if we added more rules and pieces, it would be fun again. Yeah, make it complicated as shit. Y yeah. The game's just a little simple. We can make it fun again. I love homebrew. The shadow descends on the board once again. More pieces are added, their shapes more intricate, their purposes less immediately clear, and the two of you set about discovering the complexities of the game anew. This is, this is some deep shit right now. I'm like, oh god, I know what you're trying. I know what you're trying to fucking say here, game. I know what the fuck you're trying to say. It's so very do. clear. And it is fun again. In fact, it's almost as fun as the first time you played, and the sputtering torch roars back to life. But then you get used to the additions, and the feeling starts to fade. A creeping numbness settling in over the board. More pieces are added. The feelings flare. The feelings fade. The princess suggests new rules. A glimmer of what could have been excitement flits through your mind, quickly vanishing as the game progresses. Your pieces advance in an ever-increasing slog to their destination. Hmm. That's all it is. You're just making it harder to get to the other end. Winning and losing become or nothing longer. but ends. And even the end becomes nothing as you roll over into a new game, the board resetting as many times as you can finish. Till finally... I'm out of ideas. I'm actually out of ideas this time. I don't think I can play anymore. As the words leave the princess's mouth, another torch goes out. Again, the remaining flames burn brighter, and the shadow dances faster. This is a decently long one. I'm happy, I promise. We're both so, so happy here. Oh, you very don't have to happy. Be this is awful. Isn't it great that we're all having such a lovely time together? We just have to stay positive and realize how happy we are. Then all of those lights will stay on and keep showing us all the cool stuff we have. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. See? He gets it. Don't worry about it. We should play a fight. This place isn't right. We have to. Let them rest of the man. We have to get rid of the shadow. Are you actually happy here? The princess starts to hyperventilate, her quick breaths punctuating the uncomfortable silence between you. <laughs> yes! Why wouldn't I be? <laughs> Let's not talk about it. <sighs> She's being defensive. And we all know being defensive is a sign of weakness. Hmm. We've eaten, we play games, now what? I... I don't know. But we can't do those other things anymore, can we? Maybe we can... just spend time together? Princess smiles as the two of you wait. Come on, there has to be a way out of this. This can't be the rest of our lives. This can't be forever. And wait. What's the big deal? It's nice here. We've got a lot of space, all our needs are met. We have the respect of everyone in the room. Yeah. And wait. This is what we wanted. This is what we asked for. It's good to be on top of the world. And wait. I can't do this anymore. Oh. No. I love how even, like, the narrator's getting fucked up about this. Oh, no. Oh, no! The third torch sputters out. The princess's shadow dances furiously against the far wall. There's just one left. What's going to happen when it goes out? I don't know what's going to happen. If you could do anything in the world, what would it be? What would you choose? I think I'd like to dance under the stars. Uh. 
That sounds lovely. But there aren't any stars here. I'd have to leave. Yeah. Could have had a fucking roof. A little glass roof or something, you know? As she says that, the shadow rushes forward and tightens its grip on her wrists. I'm not happy here. I don't think I ever was. Hmm. The princess sobs, burying her face in her hands as the final torch blows out. sure you want to do that content you're uh, sending us some real mixed signals boss i suppose i am I i'm just worried that i might have made a terrible mistake oh uh, yeah a terrible mistake isn't she supposed to end the entire world yes and that hasn't changed i'm just not sure the world i want is worth it character development character development but how can a saved world ever be worse than one that's gone? See, that's exactly what I thought. Think what you will. I'm only here to guide you. You're the one who makes the decisions. Well, well, looks like there's nobody around who can tell us what to do anymore. First the shadows got blown out, now even the big shot narrator man is having doubts. We don't need to waste our time slaying her. We've clearly won. And coffee now is really good, everyone. I know what I decided to do. The princess doesn't try to flee as you cross the room, murderous intent settling into your eyes. All she does is stand to face you. She offers no resistance as your fingers wrap around the blade dangling from her neck. As the weapon sinks deep into her heart, all she manages are three muttered words. It's finally over. Depression. I didn't think it would be so awful to help you see this through, but all of this was for a reason. The world is better off without. I really hope that's true. They always say it's lonely at the top. I didn't think they actually meant it. I feel... cold. But I guess I felt that way for a long, long time. Will you pierce her heart, you do not see her die, nor will you ever send for you to leave, memory returns. She's gone. Where did she go? It's finally over, kill your Should happy we ending. Try and find her? And is that a mirror? Why is it here? So I'm also gonna go back and I want I, I I'm very interested to see what we do if we what happens if we leave. I see it there on the fucking thing, and I'm like, I have to see this, that. This doesn't feel right. It feels if. Let's see. It's bad. I'm with him. Cool. There's a world beyond the endless walls of the long quiet. I'm curious to see what it means for us to know it. Uh, any thoughts? This one is a songbird in a cage of gilded shadows. She will make for an honest heart. Do not mourn her. She has finally learned to sing for herself. Hmm. The next time I see you, each of us will finally know what we are. 
I will be here, waiting for you. Yeah, she'll lay just up with like the one more. Oh, it's hard. You're a happy ending with her. You're on a path. Go back. Yeah, that locked in. Like all oh, this is my fault. She raises her head, mascara trailing down her cheeks. Your fault. We were all just trying to make things work here. It just didn't happen that way. I don't think this is the sort of thing anybody needs to apologize for. Even if we both feel empty. Even if an important part of us is gone. The princess's eyes dart to the floor. Well, we can't sit here forever. That part of us is over. Thank God. The princess pushes herself from her chair, and you instinctively do the same, waiting by the top of the stairs as she quietly crosses the room. Do you still care about me? Yes. Ah, no. Uh... What we had between us isn't real. This is real. I don't know what this is. It's something. I'd like to find out. Me too. And I don't think we're going to find anything here. So... I guess it's time for us to leave. Skedaddle skadoodle. Offer her your hand. As the princess steps towards the stairs, you offer her your hand. The corners of her mouth curl into a demure smile, and she gently takes Mule. your hand. Fuck! She gently takes your hand in hers. She's cold, a little clammy, but her skin against yours is the most real thing you've ever felt. Death Stranding. Anyway. You're offering <laughs> surprisingly little resistance. If we leave the cabin, doesn't that end the world? Bucket content. He's right, you know. You're giving us some real mixed signals, boss. Yes, well, I've seen my fairy tale ending, and I think there might be worse things than the end of the world. Well, this is less work for us anyways. Think what you will. I'm done fighting. Fuck, this one, this, this whole fucking thing might be my favorite one. Like, fucking the princess Jesus. don't exchange words as you descend the stairs to the cabin's entrance. And then oh, sad, we didn't end on this one. The world. I think this is the end of me. Even if it's not the end of you. I hope this was worth it. Genuinely, I do. He's really gone, isn't he? No boss anymore. No one left to tell us what to do. I guess we'll have to be our own boss then. About time. The stars are so beautiful. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna pass over you. Comfortable, quiet. I meant it when I said I wanted to dance. Yeah. She quietly pulls you forward, and the two of you fall into a graceful step. The only rhythm that guides you is the shared thumping of your hearts, beating in perfect unison. Her face, worn and tired, brightness brightens the faster you move, a soft, sad smile widening and widening until it reflects only genuine affection. You send her out in the wide spin, and your arms stretch to their limits, only the tenuous grasp of your hands and hers holding you together. You share a gaze that feels like it lasts forever. Thank you for taking me here. This is nice, even if it's a little cold outside. Meant to share a dance with your happy ending. Uh. 
Can I get a chance to respond? I know you have her. It's time to leave. She's cool. Where did she go? Should we try and find her? Exactly. Fucking exactly. And is that a... Never be happy. Never, ever be happy. He has anything different to say? I doubt it, but let's just check. This one is a songbird. Do not mourn her. She has finally learned to sing. Then I will. You're on a path. You're on a path. You're here. Okay. Um. So. Alright, so we have one left. So we're gonna do the night. I can wraith. Sweet. Hold on. Hold on, I wanna. Oh no, have the other items this, yeah. The last flame for everywhere, oh my god. The help of a nervous voice. Be with her hand in hand. And not in it. Oh, yeah. See through your seated eyes the end of everything. Cry. Too much there. Yeah, I'd say like that one. That one's fucking the... That, that one's... Fuck. Fuck. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you're let's path, you're here. let's go do the nightmare, the and we'll get the uh, the one the one we haven't uh, haven't gotten. Good. You watch. I am. Your own. Thank you. No. You the last. I'm guessing. Made down. Okay. Wait, so Easier. I heard the door. There's a slight effect. She barely has she or you won't. Without the okay. Yeah. The princess wounded. You've an arm. Don't as you read your No, I fucked up. <laughs> no, hold on, hold on, I fucked up. You're on a path. I fucked it up. Hold on. Oh, she will not take the blue. She gets the nightmare if I had the blade. Good. You should focus. And there you are. Are you here to- You step- Oh, I'm prop- So- She's- Then I'm not talking to you. You stare at the princess. She squints back. The two of you are gonna do this forever, aren't you? Yeah. I'm sure. For goodness sake, the two of you mm. can't just stand around like this forever. Eventually, something is going to give, and I highly recommend that you be the one to take the initiative here. <sighs> the blade tumbled. Thank you. Maybe now we can just... Against your will be done. So here we are. What an awkward... Oh. You know... That seems like a pretty good compromise. I know you... You'll be the death of all of us. Just ignore her. Maybe the banging uh, and wailing will stop if you just don't pay attention to it. Yeah, I'll pay attention, it's fine. You put the princess's threats out of your mind as best you can and huddle up against the wall. You 
jolt away. Where is she? Dude. Okay, I need to... A warning. Before you go in, she will... Run away, essentially. You reached good. Is it the... the... You cross. You were curious. Congratulations, you really lucked out. Of all the things that could have happened for I was Stephanie, curious, you know. Nothing is quite possibly the best outcome you could have gotten. <sighs> you make your way to the bottom of the stairs. As you emerge, you find your. Are you. No, I'm. I wouldn't. You turn back to the stairs, only to find that they aren't there. A faintly outlined path lies before you. There you are. I told you I- As the princess approaches, your legs suddenly go numb. Your arms- This is it, isn't it? Got your little knife with you there again. There has to be a way out of this. Think. Think. What did you do? Pull yourself- I wonder how many times I'll- Your vision- Your lungs pull in a- Wait, I'm- and then exp Okay. Are you sure about that? Heart. Lungs. Liver. Run. You turn and run. Her. Doing your best to put one useless leg in front of the other. Liver. You poor, poor thing. Wrong choice. Liver. Damn. You get nowhere before the princess is in front of you once again. Liver. I. You're always going to be a coward. She raises a hand to her mask and pulls it down. You don't get the chance to see what lies beneath before it envelops you. Like a creeping mold. The complete reality of your existence threads its way through your mind. Birth. Death. Birth again. Decay and bloom. A million uh. stitches from a million microscopic wounds you've inflicted on everyone you've ever met. With every muscle you've moved and every word you've ever spoken. Oh, good. No, 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 no. Oh, no! Let me out! Your existence hurts them. Let. Me. Out. A lonely soul in a room by itself. Weeping. It lives for 80 years and then it's gone. And then it's there again. 80 years? That's very specific. Let me out. A reprieve. A good life. Love. Children. A steady career. Recognition from your peers. Here one moment, gone the next. The worms have found their orifices. Oh. Let me out! Diagnosis. It forgets everything it is. Anger, rage, distance, poverty. The lonely soul is lonely again. Love turns to mockery. It dies. It is reborn. Worse. Lonelier. Great. You know what? Yeah, great, honestly. Let me out! No, 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 no. No, no. What's, what's happening to us? Let me out! This is all too much. I can't keep going. You can't keep going? Well, what are you talking about? He doesn't respond. Oops. I think I broke you. A bit. I'll see you soon. You'll know what to do. Your body is dead, but you live on. Chapter 3. 4, 5. The moment of clarity. You're on a path in the... Shit! Shit! What? What the hell was that? Who are we? What are we doing? There was a princess, I think. It's all so fuzzy. It hurts when I try to remember. You shouldn't know about the princess. At least, not until I... You've already been here, haven't you? Yes. I guess. It, it feels so long ago, almost like we've never left. Hmm. We have to let her out. 
No, that's the opposite of what you're here to do. You have to slay her. We might actually go to like the end. This. Because there is a, I guess, a thing here. There are some stranger endings here, so we're probably gonna go down this. Yeah. Slay. We decided not to do that, didn't we? Yeah. We're supposed to let her out. It's really the only way this works out for us. If you think about it, she's the one with power here. Nobody else can do much of anything. No, we were supposed to keep her trapped there forever. I think. Yeah, you think. We're supposed to be unfeeling. How many times do I have to tell you to snuff out your heart? We can't be unfeeling. Not when there's so much fear everywhere. There's nothing for us to do. We've already tried everything. Mm. We love her, so we have to set her free. Can we love something that hates us? Can we love something that hurts us? Yes, yes you can. <laughs> to be given an ounce of kindness from something so cruel would be more pure than any other love. Oh. Why are there so many of us? <sighs> there aren't supposed to be so many of us. This is bad. You need to get a grip. What did you let happen? How many times have you been here? It's only the third. Good question. How many times have you all been here? Many, 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 many times. It feels like we've been here forever. But it also feels like we've barely been here at all. Yeah? It doesn't matter. Yes, we just have to do what she says and then everything will be fine. Right. It won't. It will be for us. She said so. You're part of everything. If things aren't fine for everything, they won't be fine for you. There's no difference between fine and not fine. It just goes on and on. This makes sense. I remember being here twice before this and some of you don't remember being here at all. Was I here those other times? Did someone else make the decisions? What does here even mean if you really think about it? Oh my god. Shut up. You were here. Every single time. You did your best, really. There's just a pecking order. And our cruel and beautiful goddess sits atop it, right where she's always belonged. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> You're lucky. What I would give to be able to forget. I've tried to keep them numb, but they're all too soft. A shame, really. If I remember what I did, then it wouldn't have been me that did it. Don't think about that too hard. All it will do is weaken your resolve and make it that much harder for you to slay her. Right. Maybe you're shattered in your own way. A bit. Are you your memories, or are you the one perceiving the present moment? Ugh, here you go philosophizing again. It never goes anywhere. Yes, this is far from the first time you've asked us about consciousness. Who am I? What am I? What is I? Who even cares? They're good questions, great questions even, but they don't have any answers, and they all just end in quivering torment. Hmm. It doesn't matter what we do, because we always find her, and if we don't find her, she always finds us. Mm. And then she smashes us into smaller pieces. Smash us with a hand! If you all just stopped feeling, we could have been done with this ages ago. Fucking spooky with the music here, goddamn. Your thoughts are far too scattered to rein back in. Your only option is to silence them. My way out is do nothing, so nothing I will do is stay more. Proceed. Let's go. You slowly make your way through the umbral forest, bumping against unseen trees as you grasp through the darkness for a way forward. But eventually, you do make it to the cabin. Damira! Or rather, you make it to the place a cabin should have been. Instead, all you find is an empty hill. 
No, no, this isn't right. There's a cab in there. There's always supposed to be a cab in there. Don't ask him about the mirror. Yeah. He always says he never sees it. He always lies. And he always makes it gone. Stay focused. You still have a job to do, and it's best not to be distracted by fraying thoughts. There is no mirror. You know that as well as I do. Me, 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 me. She's still here, buried deep inside the earth. Just walk up the hill. You always give too much space to the others. It's why you always lose. Hmm. Giving them space, what if it helps them? What if they need to be hurt? They've been hurt too much. It's why they are the way they are. Exactly. They are delusions, and all that catering to them will do is drag you down to their level. You have to keep moving. Or you could just give up. Approach. You walk up the hill, hesitating just beyond the bounds of the cabin. The cabin that isn't there. You've got to clean the mirror, haven't you? You've got to see what's in it. Smash it to pieces. She's on the other side, and we have to let her out. It's the only way we can be free. Set me free. It's the only way we can have our thoughts back. Just go around it. Just go around, yeah. Just do something. It doesn't matter what. Proceed. Proceed? Proceed to where? I'm afraid you're going to have to be a little more specific. What part of proceed don't you understand? That's a new one. Do you think it'll work? Of course it'll work. He always makes the best decisions. It's why he gets to make them. It fucking exactly. And it already has worked. It's gone, don't you see? We're one step closer to her. The interior of the cabin is much the same as the exterior of the cabin. A dull, fuzzy, dreamlike nothing. It's empty and isolating, but there's just enough vague shape and unknown texture to suggest the structure therein. Wrong and unsettling as it may be. Mm. The only object of note is a pristine blade buried in the dirt floor, a hint of its shining edge teasing through the sediment. The blade is your implement. You'll need it if you're going to do this right. He said the thing. Take it. It's the only way forward. You have to take the blade. You reach down to take the blade. Oh. As you do, the ground beneath it shifts, the weapon sinking deep into the earth. What the fuck? You lean over the hole and gaze into the abyss. It is so very deep. Does it stare back? Deep in the bowels of the earth. Oh, it does! It fucking so. does! <laughs> She's watching us. She never stops watching us. Even the whole bowels of the earth, you see something staring back at you, it fills you with dread. There you are. My toy has finally come to finish his job. Oh, great. With every word she speaks, the princess oh. in the pit blinks closer. You dragged this off for so much longer than you had to. I died, uh, yeah. And closer. But it was always just a matter of time. And closer. You are going to have to stop running eventually. And closer. Everything stops running eventually. Except for me. Yeah, I bet. I've already taken your will, and you're not getting it back. And it's not as weird to take my will. And that? Me. Out. It'll be so much fun. You and me, together, exploring the world and spreading fear wherever we go. Well, mostly just me. But you'll get to be there too. A witness. I can even make you a little cage if you want. Gilded and everything. I'm just a bird in a cage. Bird up. Now don't pause. Don't try to resist. I've already molded you into what I need. And you lost your power so long ago. Don't bother working yourself into a frenzy to get it back. Do something. Do anything that isn't taking her hand. Just take her hand. I just have to get a tool. You were once something else a long time ago. That was something you. Or just 
Go on, Jade Memory. There's no other ending here. Just take her hand and set her free. You extend your hand to hers. For all her past cruelties, the moment feels gentle. Tender, even. I can't believe you just made me say that. I hate you. Good. The motion is difficult at first, as if something still resists your efforts. But then that resistance gives way, and it's over. <sighs> and that's the end. I wonder what we're going to do next. I didn't think I'd be so... tired. The princess exhausted slumps. Why is it so cold? You know? Do you not get a chance to respond or you ever? It's time to leave. Memory returns. She's gone. Yeah. I can finally think again. Almost. That mirror's back. What does that mean for us? I'm sure it'll be whisked away just like her. Maybe it won't be gone. Things are different now, aren't they? Doesn't seem like there's much else to do here. Finally! <sighs> We can smash it. Yeah. No. Oh, will you stop with the smashing? What do we say, Heck boys? You. One last vain attempt to look at ourselves. Yeah. I think I'd like that. Seems we've got a majority. All that's left is to give it a look. It's in a book. It's a fucking mirror. <laughs> Something tells me that this is the end of the line. But. I don't feel bad about it. I'm ready. It feels... okay. The fear's... gone. Oh, I'm done fighting. My heart feels... quiet. The game was always going to end. The game was rigged from the start. I'll be free of all of you. I'm ready for the truth. I'm ready to sleep. I'm just ready to be anywhere that isn't here. Shut up! Boys, it's been an honor. Gaze into your reflection. Mm. Up. A fitting one to get at the end here. I think you know what I am. You wanna hold on. And both of you to an incomplete existence. Look at that. Try. This man. A construct. It was supposed to keep the two of you trapped here until the job was done. And it was supposed to guide your hand to help you see things through. The construct you're in exists in every world at once. Any time you failed, any time you thought yourself dead, it would restart and shunt both you and her into a new world. Mm. But you're waking up to your true nature now. It won't be able to work like that anymore. What is my true identity? You're the long quiet. The god I made to rid the world of death. Hmm. I'm supposed to rid the world of death. By slaying the princess. Once she's gone, everyone will get to exist exactly as they are. No more fear. No more howling chaos. Just life. Forever. But that's strange. It's about dying. I've died plenty of times. You haven't. You've flirted with dying. You've played pretend. But your consciousness is an unbroken stream. Hmm. How do you know everybody else? Else doesn't also experience death the way I do. They obviously don't. You experience death the way you do by design and by your unique nature. you're wrong I don't think things bad at all and you're just making all this up as you go 
If you really want to waste valuable time telling me I'm wrong when we both know I'm not, then that's your prerogative. I'm pretty sure death is good, actually. Important, even. If that's your belief, there's nothing I can say to move you. You haven't died. You cannot die. So you can't grasp the abject horror of dying. About there beyond the walls of this country. Do they know about this? Do they know what you want me to do to them? Of course not. The only way this construct could function was if nobody knew what it was doing. But the bones of the universe are old. It's on the cusp of its dying breath, and the people out there are consumed with thoughts of oblivion. Hmm. When the patterns are wiped from the sand, when the board is reset, who will remember them? All I've done is given them a chance to live outside of the shadow of the end. Right. Hell, the dialogue I did. I, I've always just, after like the first one, I just always just smashed it. Princess, did you make her too? She is the shifting mound, the ebb and flow, the capacity to change. She's she seen transformation, or most of it. Her nature is why I had to die, for she becomes that which others perceive her to be. But an echo can't perceive things, not in the way that people can. Honestly, this, this whole game is fucking zinch coded. <laughs> so I tucked a part of myself into the folds of this construct to guide you. Hmm. Seems that every me you met did a real shit job of it, though. Eh. Bugs, I went all the way through the top. What if neither of us leave this place? Does that work? Can we just stay here together and leave the people out there alone? It wouldn't work. Her nature as the shifting mound makes it so nothing can last forever as it is now. It wouldn't matter how long the two of you waited. Eventually, she would find a way to leave, and then... Everything would change. Everything would face oblivion. Hmm. And until then, the clock ticks on. Say nothing and watch him. I've said my piece, and my time is up. I'm just an echo, and every echo fades away. You know what you have to do. What the hell that last little image is? It was right, you are the long quiet of ass nascent god, and it's finally time for you to wake up all of this. All of this is you. A wise moment, bring the moment of clarity to you. Right the heart of things, there's no final vessel for you to bear witness to. There's nothing for you to find. Mwah. Seems like I have to ask like a very specific series of questions. Maybe. I can finally see you, and you can finally see me. Okay, so you need to bring her any her vessels. Play her something else, change you. Take blade. Oh, this is how we get all the voices. Violence has always been a language, hasn't it? Let's see if all these. Is what it is. There are a few things more terrifying than one's own heart. And there is almost nothing more terrifying than sharing it with another. But the most terrifying thing of all is to leave one's heart unshared. You are the only thing like me, and I am the only thing like you. Could you bear the weight of an eternity alone? Do you dare to shape a reality of solitude and thrust it on creation? Thrust. Yeah. 
Oh, you're sharing yourself with me. I'm aware of what it did to you. The understanding of return to me is a gift. A picture of a life, and a picture of a life, and a picture of a life. How deep must repetition still our movements, until even the air we breathe is stale? You doused the flames of false devotion, and in my despair, you tore down the walls and freed us both from a mockery of life. Would you rebuild those walls and throw the world in them? Would you keep them in that box we shared and tell them that they're happy? As a matter we don't have all the... Not to be like that, you can find a better way to make things better. What we saw was a world without me. Everything will be okay, so long as we leave together. You are weightless and alone, suspended in the gravity of an idea too great for you to hold. A tiny island caught between the death of the old and the birth of the new. But you did not go quietly. You Big. spat in the eye of that which would claim godhood, and through that defiance, you bound us both together. Without me, there are no externalities to resist. And without you to resist me, there can be no externalities. It is struggle that carves meaning into consciousness. Uh, okay. The open mouse turning the favor. You linger in moments that have long since passed. We changed each other. Are you not happy with who you've become? What once was one, then was two, and then was one again. You gave me shelter when you burned mine down, and then you struck another match. I pulled you from the ruins, and then we built a life. What once was one, then was one again. The peace didn't last. The worm in your heart came for us. A worm! It took you from me, and then you left. What once was one, then was two. But it could be one again. Hmm. You and I are bound together. To rid yourself of me would be to leave yourself forever incomplete. Because we're bound together doesn't mean I can't be whole without you. Could you bear the risk of seeking that truth? What if you're wrong? Hey, it's just like your smelling is the respite is welcome. Are you still committed to my destruction? Or has your resolve started to waver? Nothing is immutable. If there is no constant, you cannot remove something. Open your eyes. Happens if you want. everything down. Well, then try to destroy me if you can. But I will not yield easily to your delusion. Also, I'm kind of scared about something because I think, like, it's supposed to be the first one, so it's supposed to be, like, the last one we're supposed to get. I don't know. You don't have to face her alone. Apparently well, that's yeah. not true. You'll never be able to strike it as there's still a piece of me. Nest it's time to resume. She's relentless, isn't she? Too bad. <sighs> this is just back. Wait. Here we are. I'd say we're back here at all started, but I guess it's a little difficult after that. Oh, yep. Yeah. No, this is different. Do you need me to describe things? That'd be nice. A little hey! comfort in an almost unfamiliar place. Oh. You made it here too. That's right, that's right. We never really got to talk to her, did we? <laughs> this one, I mean. Description, uh, mind for old times, Yeah, of course. The interior of the cabin is, well, it's not really a cabin, is it? It's that terrifying blend of everything. Only it doesn't feel so terrifying anymore.
It's still shaped like a cabin, it's just different in places. There's still walls, a door to the basement, a table, that knife. Windows. I was looking at the chart. You know, come to think of it, I don't think he ever really included the windows in his cabin descriptions, did he? I didn't, did he? I always thought they were implied. He never mentioned the mirror either, but that didn't mean he implied it was there. Hmm. It's gone, though. I think it did whatever it needed to do. Right. And I know I've already mentioned it, but if we want to see this through, we're going to need that blade. Chris, did anyone else make it to the cabin? It's just us. I think the rest of them are still out there, jumbled up in the rest of her. And I've been here since you left me here. No hard feelings. I'm mm. just glad you're back to see this through. Yeah, it's dead silent in here. Whatever it was that was left of him, I don't think it could handle you waking up to godhood. Pretty sure he got obliterated. Really goes to show how much you've grown up. Killing somebody across every iteration of reality just by existing. I don't even know what I would do if I were in the driver's seat with that kind of power. Yeah, huh. <laughs> How's it feel about him being gone? That's probably for the best. It's always seems to give us more things we can do, right? That's not technically true. So you're not going to suggest we throw it out the window? No, we've been through too much for that. And he's gone, so there's no one left to mess with but ourself. You've gotten serious. Mm. Besides, what's the third beat? It isn't funny if I suggest that twice, especially since you never took me up on it last time. There's the guy I know. Mm. No. It's Those funny, but no. Stairs again. But now there's only one way forward. Do you remember the first time we were here? The first time we heard her voice? Yeah, it was a real mess. Stopped being fun pretty quick. Save. I mean, I save there, but... You know. It's okay. You can come down. The stairs won't bite. Not this time. Oh, thank God. Let's talk one last time before you kill us, if that's still what you want to do. She doesn't sound messy anymore, though. At least somebody here feels put together. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yep. And forward we go. We shouldn't keep her waiting. Correct. That was easy compared to last. Fuck. Last time, just stairs. No weird fuzzy stuff or nonsense. Trying to pull us out. Yeah. That wasn't so bad. Not too bad at all. Even after everything you've seen, and all the lives we've lived together, you still want to kill us. The Echo really got his hooks into you. Unless you have your own reasons for wanting us dead? So this is really it then. Let's see this through. So, you've made a choice for all of us. Correct. Even through everything. Through all the worlds we've seen and experienced. Through all the lives we've known and lost. We could never imagine a world without you and us. It doesn't feel possible. Despite it all, We've always loved you. Oh. We hope you don't regret what comes next. You like the prince is gone, all you have left is her small, melancholic weight that sits at the borders of your heart. Whatever action brought you and the princess into being was rough and jagged and left each of you with a piece of the other. By destroying her once and for all, you also destroyed a part of yourself, but the world hasn't ended. Things she's gone. gone. And I don't think she's coming back. No, she's not. Then we did what we set out to do. Come on, let's get going. We don't need to linger down here anymore. Leave. That's right. 
We've got a whole world to see. A whole new world. There's a basement behind. Then the stairs. And you leave the cabin itself. It's quiet here. Yeah, there's not a lot for us to do, is there? The path in the woods outside the empty canvas, but there's even more sea balance place. The fruits of your labor are world free from death. With a glass construct pressing in on you, confining you across infinite sides, infinite angles, you push back, constrained against it. Come on now. It shouldn't be that hard to break out of here. We're some sort of god, aren't we? You would think. He's gone. She's gone. No one is left to trap us here but us. And bear witness to the to your new kingdom. It's finally over. I knew we'd finally see it through. We really did win, didn't we? We're the house now. We get to make the rules. This is nice. Absolute reality. The whispering. That wasn't very hard. Speak for yourself. Well, boy, I hope this was all lucky for us. Time mends a lot of things. You'll get better. Here, here. I guess I had some to of them here at the end. I didn't have all of them. Welcome back, everyone. It's great to uh. see you all again. Now we just have to figure out what to do with ourselves. Forever. No problem. We could do that. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. We can do that. choices there approaching the mirror approach a mirror what wow I can't be Seat. I can just talk to you before you were taken away. Not you, at least. I'm sorry for what I did. That's okay. No hard feelings. In a way, you helped us become a version of her. But we weren't very good at it. I don't think a conversation with us then would have been very insightful. That's probably why we are taken away. That's all we had to offer you. It was time to change again. After all we did, she's just forgiving us. Just like that. You know, that means a lot. I don't think I want to be Hard a god. Seems overrated. Too much pressure. But that's what you've always been. Even now. You can't put aside such an important part of who you are. And neither can we. So, you might as well embrace it. Same as you are out there. Yes, we think. We're kind of like a shadow. Out there, every part of us is blended together into one huge idea. A big wave of unyielding change crashing against the world. Mm. But in here, we're fractured. Small. Still a little more separate than we'd like to be. Our instincts still trying to pull us in different directions. That's kind of like us, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. We really are the same. I want to, to slay the you out there. It's easy to want to kill an abstract concept when this is a person as weird as a person as you are. Who are you calling weird? You. <laughs> Just kidding. We know we're weird. And so are you. Ah, yikes. Uh, I don't want to hurt anyone. There has to be a way out of this. You don't think there's a way for us to leave. But maybe there doesn't have to be an ending. The way it all works seems to be based on you. If you believe we can do something, then we can do it. So believe that we can put it all back. 
Believe we can fix the Echo's construct and make us all forget. Believe we can send us all back to the beginning, before anyone woke up, before the truth consumed us. Can they really do that? Are you sure that's what you want? Why wouldn't it be what we want, especially if it brings him back? We can't keep going without a nemesis. Sending uh, do anything to help them. If you vote there, if you continue to exist, then they don't continue to die and suffer. If you believe we can give them more time, then we can give them more time. It's all up to you. Yeah. Don't underestimate the power of our thoughts. You've seen what they can do. You haven't even seen the half of it. We don't want to forget you. We don't want to forget you either, but that's what we would have to do. A single tear forms in one eye and slides down their cheek. Sorry, couldn't help myself. Eh. We don't think we ever really forget, anyway. There's always something that draws us back together. Some buried memory that both of us treasure. Hmm. We'll find ourselves back here eventually. And when we do, we can choose to do it all again. We'll always be able to start over, if that's what all of us want. You're talking about this right now, I know we've done this before. Maybe we have. Maybe we haven't. We can't know something like that. But we're choosing to do it now. And maybe we'll just keep doing it again and again, forever. Forever and ever. It's almost comforting. To know we can keep meeting each other over and over again. How do you know things will just end worse? What if I make my way back here every time I hurt you? What if I kill you? What if I let you bring about the end of everything? That's okay. We have to be able to trust that whatever choices we make, they're the right choices. Maybe we'll continue the loop of forgetting and restarting forever. Or maybe we'll decide at some point that it's time for things to end. Because our memories will be gone, we'd have to decide to do this every single time forever. Eventually, something is going to be different. When we first met each other in the long quiet, there was something inside of us. Something we couldn't recognize or understand. And we can't say we fully understand it now. A warmth when we look at you. The kind you don't realize you're missing until it's come back. Every time we hurt each other, every time something awful happened, it was still there. Undercutting the pain on the surface with a constant, soothing glow. Hmm. That warmth is never going to go away. And that's why we believe in you. Uh. Hey, I want to be here with you. I don't want to be alone again. You'll be back here again. Sooner than you think. That's like four hours. And we'll part ways again. And find each other. And part ways. And find each other. It's like we're never really alone. Because even the time we... That's beautiful. God damn it. Because even the time we spend apart is the time spent chasing these moments in reunion. They're all the sweeter for the isolation in between, don't don't you think? I, I agree with that, actually. You've really grown our hearts, haven't you? <laughs> is there any other way? Our options are limited to what that knife offers us. Either we use it to put things back, or you kill us. We're sure you can figure out which one we'd prefer. But we don't want to influence you. We're sure you'll do what you think is best. If it's time for it to be over, it's time for it to be over. As much as we might want a few more precious lifetimes with you. No, but I don't want to kill you. It's too late to go back to being God. There's no turning back now. You came down here with the knife, which means the knife has to get used. Or there wouldn't have been any meaning to taking it. And this place is all about meaning. But if that's what you want, you can always hope that the next you will want that too. But there's only one way to give him that choice. Yeah. We're already here, and we've already brought the blade. And nobody wanted to throw it out the window. We can't just go back now one way or another we'll have to see this through there's your third beat hey you're right there it is can't say it's very funny though I know that 
one that one is different hold on hold on we should we should actually do that hold on hold on hold on hold on okay if this is your choice then I have your back I guess I'll see you on the other side speak for yourself maybe I'll see you too maybe I won't they take the blade from our hand and stare fondly into our eyes. I love you. We love you too. Everything is going to be okay. Stab. You're on a path in the you're here. To I didn't seem different. Huh? There's no need to apologize. We are what we are, and this is in your nature. Even through everything, through all the worlds we've seen and experienced, through all the lives we've known and lost, we could never imagine a world without you and us. It doesn't feel possible. Despite it all, we've... Is that a metaphor? Re Fantasio. We ah, she's on that again. If I am a g death is a fantasy. You have never what I offer you. You've been surviving on your own, but you're never going to get through to her while she's like this. There's still a piece of me nestled close to where it all began. It's time to res- She's really- You can't, and lucky- That's probably for the best. So, no, we- You've gone- Besides, there's the- You actually did it! I yeah! Know I just told you not to, but I'm proud that you did it anyways. It's like you've finally left the nest. Yeah. Just like that, it's gone, isn't it? Blade tossed, glass shattered. He's still there. I guess we'll have to make do without it. There's your third beat. Hey! <laughs> You're right. Good work. That was really funny. I go there, the blade, yeah. Winter. Those winding stairs again. I don't know what you want from us. Let's forward. talk, all of us. Maybe we can help you find she your She doesn't way. sound meh. And forward we go. That was easy com yeah that was so you didn't bring the knife after all the lives we've lived together and all the lives we haven't you somehow found a way to move outside of the script yeah wacky huh are we missing a page see it that's okay no hard feelings in a way you helped us become a version of her but we weren't very good at it a conversation with us then probably wouldn't have been very insightful. Mm. That's probably why we were taken away. That's all we had to offer you. 
It was time to change again. After all we did, she's just forgiving us. Yeah. Just like that. You know, that means a lot. It is, for all of us. This is all different. We've seen so many threads of stories told between us, but this moment is... unexpected. Even when we've seen it all, you still managed to surprise us. Thank you. Very surprising. Over here. Yes, we think. We're kind uh -huh. of like a shadow. Out there, every part of us is blended together into one huge idea. A big wave of unyielding change crashing against the world. But in here, we're fractured. Small. Still a little more separate than we'd like to be. Our instincts still trying to pull us in different directions. That's kind of like us, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. We really are the same. Give her what she wants us to be. We don't know. We've seen through so many eyes, but all of them have been hers. We like you as you are. We like us as we are. Maybe we would have liked her version of us too. Turning the wheel of the cosmic cycle together. But that's not the choice you made. Even though she did everything in her power to convince you. Mm -hmm. It took courage for you to make your way down here. Away from the paths others would have had you walk. We find that courage beautiful. Thank you. But that's the worst part of us. That's me she's talking about. I think that's the point. There is no worst part of us. Because it's all terrible. Equally. Hard agree. Seems overrated. Too much pressure. Correct. But that's what you've always been. Even now. You can't put aside such an important part of who you are. And neither can we. So, you might as well embrace it. Eh. Like he did the first thing, is this the real you? It's so tempting to speak as she would. To simply state that we're all of them. But there were also something new. We don't know if you'll find that answer satisfying. Yeah. <laughs> Perhaps you'd rather hear that we're the first version of her that you've met, but that we've been shaped by the experiences of all of the others. Right. Yes. That feels right to us. It's her. It wouldn't make sense if she was anyone else. We're here and anything funny, tell me your name. We're just a stranger. But that doesn't mean we have to be distant from you. It just means that we'll always be able to find new things to discover in each other. Hmm. That's sweet. But it's also a little sad. I think it's only sad if we want it to be sad. Very fair, this was it. Is it unfair if it's our fault? Was it not? We found you at the end of all things. And you found us. Is that not fair? Would this moment be what it is without the pain that built to it? We know we must sound like her, but it's how we feel. Everything that happened to us seems so important now. We walked a long and winding path together, and we've cherished every second of it. Hmm. Besides, I don't think fairness has much to do with anything. Uh, why don't we just leave? He'd hate that. So you should do it. Yeah. Even if he isn't here anymore, it's the spirit of the thing. Leave? But what would happen if we left with you? Would we exist inside ourselves? Are you sure you want to find out if that's possible or what that would mean for you? Is that what you want? Leave with you, but I didn't like being a god. I want to walk through the cabin door. Just keep it simple. I'll leave with you, but I didn't really want to walk. I just wanted to be cabin. Just you and me. After so many iterations, so many different versions of us clashing and coming together and clashing again, leaving with you feels like all we ever really wanted. I think I'm gonna stay right here. Whatever you're doing right now, wherever you're going. Yeah, I think we've done our job. You don't want to come? Yeah, it wouldn't feel right. But I'll be okay. We'll be okay. See? 
I'm not even alone. If he's here with me, I'm sure we can find the others too. In the basement pan for the last time. Sheriff themselves, I know, I'm sure existence. They're about to play more, they know this, yet they still are. They cross the room, the door outside, pulling you excitedly with them. We can feel the threads of all the stories we've told together, all pulling us back down the stairs and into those chains where we know the outcome of everything that could ever come to pass. It's comfortable there, but it's confining. We want more. We want whatever might be on the other side of this door. Something new that we'll experience together. With someone who exists outside of us. Yeah, a five hit wife. Yeah, she does have a... It only looks like three because you're just looking at her like dead on. But yeah, she's got a lot of heads. With someone who can see us Head? in a way we can never see ourselves. And we love you too. Yeah, let's just that again. Yeah, because I'm like, I'm looking at the chart here. It's like, okay, bring her any vessels except the string. Oh, wait, no. You got the wrong thing. Strangers, the first vessel, bring her any of the four vessels next. Slay her, something else, change you. Take the blade, slay the princess, reassure the voice before approaching the other voices. You should go like up there. Oh, that's weird. That seems very strange. Okay, so I think. Okay, I think this is literally now. We just need to go get a. You're on a pump. You're here. We'll do easy. We'll do. Uh, you make your way up. Because uh, the we're gonna, we're gonna do the razor because the razor. The razor's an easy. Uh, Good. You're still listening to reason. You step forward. I'm positive. You charge the princess, blade in hand, but on blood spray. Are you serious? The wound in your neck is too much for you to bear. The princess stands over you with an intense curiosity as you fade away. Oops. Everything goes dark. Yeah, I didn't realize the fucking die. the last part of the mirror is important. You're on a path in the woods. And at the end of that path is a cabin. And in the basement of that cabin is a princess. You're here to sleep. Let me... Wait, no, I can access the memories from here. Oh, shit, I've been doing this stupidly the whole time. Uh, also, we've gotten everything, which is good. Uh... Other ones we could get, but I don't know. I'm not, I'm not gonna worry about it too much. She went just. The interior of the cabin is a jagged mess of warped wood and broken boards.
Are we really doing this without a weapon? You know she has one, right? I got five kind of for you, but I'm not trying anything. Of course I won't. Against your better judgment, you walk across the room to within arm's reach of the princess. I don't like the way you said, within arm's reach. <sighs> you hear the horrible sound of metal slicing through meat. Who's meat? Not ours, right? No, it couldn't be. Hers, at first, then yours. Your neck, specifically. Hell yeah. Again? Really? Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> you collapse to the ground, your vision swimming as you attempt to focus on her bloody blade and the limp sack of flesh that was once her arm. You're going to die now. And with a quick jerk yes. of her elbow, she does just that. Everything goes dark, and you die. You're on a path in the woods. You make your way... Oh... We're fighting her. Yes. Are you forgetting the part where the cheeky one thought it'd be funny to throw our only weapon out the window? It was funny. I mean, it was funny. Even she said it was funny. Oh yes, it was absolutely hilarious. Yes. And we'll all be laughing together once we're out of here. If we make it out of here, oh, I don't know. That seems unlikely. I'm gonna punch her now. Ooh, someone's mad. Oh. Okay. Why not? Fists raised. You <sighs> the princess. Oh, so you do want to fight, huh? Okay. Hit me. Hit me and see what happens. I'll give you a free shot and everything. Here goes. We can make this work. And what if we don't? Your fist Whack. slams into the princess's face, and she recoils in pain. We actually did something to her. Wow. Ow, 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 ow. That hurt. What are your bones made of? Metal? Yeah, because I bet yours are. Because mine are. Ah. Before you can react, she returns a punch of her own. Only it isn't really a punch. Yes, we all know she has swords for arms. We have eyes. Well, she skewers you. Hell yeah. Ow. Ribbons! I'm going to make you ribbons! This is so much fun and I want to celebrate! It would have worked if we punched harder. Clearly! Oh, a new one of us. I thought that only happens when we die. Nah, you're right. I think we're dead. And that's all we'll ever Done any others, we just have to keep dead. Pushing. Yeah, I'll pass on that. Come on! Show me something new! Is again and again and again memory blurs conscious leaves this is none of this is working. Think. Think. She skewers you. Well, there's more of us. Let's see if that helps. Just keep dodging. Just keep dodging. Just keep dodging. She skewers you. What's the point of avoiding me if you're not more noise isn't helping. It's just compliment her on those gleaming blades. Mm. There's nothing better than a capable woman. She skewers you. You're cute. It doesn't matter Shut. how many times this takes. We don't even have Yeah. Again, no. I'll just panic. Flee. It's all better nature. I haven't tried that. I'm sure she'll listen to me. She skewers you. And then everything goes dark. What just happened? I think you know. Smash! Ever. Violence has always been our language. A boundless torrent of blades cuts you from boundless angles. You died countless. Humble yourself. You speak of me as if I am a ghost. A 
picture of a life and a picture of a life and if you douse the flames of fire would you rebuild those walls and throw the world in I sunk my blade in your heart because you I didn't need you I still don't need you until death is a fantasy only those who lack perspective see it as anything other than transformation you cannot destroy me you are weightless and alone Suspended in the gravity of an idea too, but you did not go quietly without When you became a shadow of a god, you're still bound to my will. I denied your apothesis then and I will deny your apothesis now. You have never truly seen me gone. You cannot fathom a world without me. What once was one, then was two. I pulled you from the ruin. When your spirit possessed my body, I excised you from my heart, and then you tried to take me with you. I left languish there's nothing you can do to me that lasts Enough. oh different 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 the princess dives into you once more but this time no lone figure claws its way to the surface instead you are swept up in the whole of her multi uh, multitudes an infinite tide crashing against you. they are like gnats against your divine skin oh, i am the threat that weaves nothing into something tears into your hand and fist and tooth and claw the pace of your dance quickening and quickening and quickening but the faster you moves the more easily you keep pace you have already seen the path to victory she strikes again you catch her hands clasping your wrists and wings binding her arms a fervor rises in her multitudes as they struggle against you but you remain unmovable in your resolve hands over her shoulders slump her limbs go slack. You see defeat in her many eyes. This shouldn't be possible. What are you? What can you ever hope to be without me to define your shape? Word. Please, don't do this to yourself. It's funny. The time for speech is over. You'll make her see your truth. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Something wacky. Offer her your hand. You offer me your hand as if you've proven me wrong, but I'm not wrong. I can't be wrong. Uh, I feel like you lit up your own ass. You just haven't listened to me. Whatever you're trying to do right now, you don't have to do it alone. You need a better place to strike from if you're going to land a decisive blow. I can help you with that. There's still a piece of me nestled close. It's time to resume our dance. She's relentless, isn't it? Then let's go. It's just all the same. The knife's not there. Those windings. Yeah, it was a. Is this different? We thought we could see everything, but this is outside of the script. Are we missing a page? He'd hate that. After so. We can feel the threads of all the- It's comfortable there, with someone who can see us in a way we can never see ourselves. Okay. That- that just- that, that just sets you back on the path. Destroy her. She's gone, you are truly alone. There are worse things to be d than alone. Your conscious sits at the center of the long quiet, the center of yourself. With nothing left to strike, you can finally feel its edges, the artificial constraints put in place by a lesser thing that you can never hope to understand you. There are infinite folds into itself endlessly. Your cage it can only imprison you as long as you didn't notice it. It has your full attention now. Water! Is that real life? That's real water! Your thought it might break, it falls apart. You see it, a world free from death. You know well, never moving, but never decaying. A world of uninterrupted experience. What things you putting in it? Now, uh, what 
It is yours. What brings you pray carve into eternity to experience you? What textures will you weave for yourself to occupy forever? You know what? There are worse things than to be alone. I guess. Oh shit, wait, that was everything? Oh shit, that was it. That was the, uh, the new. Oh no, that wasn't. Hmm. What did, uh, hmm. I guess we got everything because we, we, we got all the all the scenes. I mean, there might be like new dialogue and such. But... As far as I'm concerned, I think we got everything. Yeah, I thought I'd have to like go back and uh, do things. And of course, there's still like, you know, all the little images and stuff we still got to get. But That's not really like stream worthy. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do that do that like on my own time really really there's fucking like all of like the furious that they'll do and the fury Eek. yeah yeah I, I'll, I'll say this again I think like d definitively it's this Happily ever. This one's my fucking favorite. This is the good shit. I don't know which ones. Oh, actually, let's look that up. Uh, play the. Yes. Hi. No. I feel like, I feel like, I feel like we end on this. Game, game plus finishing new routes before rings parts. It's happily ever after cage, dragon, hypothesis, den, fury. I guess those are like the new ones. Alright, I was just looking at, just looking at things. I don't know, I was hoping, like, the new thing was gonna be, like, a little, something a little different. I don't know. I don't know, I thought, I thought, I thought there was gonna be something, uh, something else. Let me just Let's get that and everything. Guys, I think, I think, like, this is, like, the new, getting this, I guess. 
All this stuff at the bottom here. I don't know, I just thought, I just thought it would have been something, something like wacky, you know, something more, but oh well. Oh well, I like, I like the fucking ones where we go, we go to the door, right? That's, 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 that's like, that's like the definitive end for me right there. That's, that's it. I thought like, God, we're gonna like, have like, all like, all like the, vo I mean, this one we get all the voices and stuff and everything, but, you know. You know, and like, I know like just going back is just gonna not with her, at least it's like the same thing, so it doesn't really matter. Great. Does bringing her off her hand destroy her? It's just like, what happens next? It's weird because, like, a path in the woods, strange, doesn't change anything? It seems like it did. Oh, that's weird. I don't know, man. It's weird. I still, I still didn't get the one where she breaks her own chains. This means that you just, just fucking this, <laughs> fucking this. You good? You did? You said it anyway. I get it. I fucking get it. Wow. It's this. But uh, yeah, yes. Yeah. So I thought I thought I was gonna have to like re re go through it and like not do the. The, uh, whatever ending there. But, uh, no, I guess not. So, let's do a... Screenshot that last one. I just wanna, I just wanna get their, uh... Slay. Slay, queen. One more thing. The credits. Okay. But violence has defined the flow of everything between us. Do not deny what we are. And do not color our conflict with fear. I just want to get her. A picture of a life, and a picture of a life, and a picture of a life. How deep must repetition still our mood? Oh, is it? You speak. What you mistake for lecture is merely observation. You can vainly struggle. That cold fire has left your eye. Doing. I'm gonna take that. That's probably. F Yeet. Right. <laughs> I had to. <laughs> I had to. After. Don't mention it. Thanks. There we go. There we go. Hours. Also, God, I love, I love that little. Love that. I love that at the end there. That's good. I just want, I just want to get our, our final, our final little screenshot there. All right. Yeah, also, like the thorn. The thorn was really good. Like the thorny rose's heart. She's going to swallow a spider, isn't she? Oh. Eat the knife. <laughs> Okay, with that all said and done, being done with Slay the Princess now, we I will probably not be streaming this again. If I do play it again, I'll I'll be doing playing it like on my own time, just kind of hundred percenting it probably because God, there is still 
Okay, 80 out of 131. There is a lot of achievements. The love will be set free. In her nature. Past the point of no return. Going back now, let's hit her. I didn't get her. Um, it's like different versions of her. I need to like bring back to her. Like, there is so much if you want to like 100% this. You get all the choices. The voice ruin your happy ending. Um, Stop. She's found a creature. Visit when you fall. Finish the gallery. Oh, this arm a harsh companion. Right. But with that, I want to thank you all for coming on by, watching me fucking play some slay the princess enjoy enjoy the many many different routes and god if you want to see all the different things i didn't get to you should go pick up the game for yourself because this is still a bunch of little scenes and stuff like god there's still like all of like the fury i didn't really do we only we only did her like once um yeah it was good it was good shit good shit good shit um I very much enjoyed uh, Slay the Prince, like, like the whole way through. I don't think it was any particular part like I didn't like, really. Like, not, not really. Um, I, had, I, I've thoroughly enjoyed the whole thing again. This fucking route, th this, this version of her is probably like my favorite one. I loved, I loved the little, little messaging there, you know, so. Uh, I understood that. I get it. I fucking, I fucking get that. You know, you know, I get it. I get, I get, I get, I get, I get what you're trying to say there, game. Why shouldn't you think I don't see it? Um, but, uh, yeah, it's, it, it's, it was a, like, it's very well written. The, 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 the kind of whole thing with, like, the death and change and everything like that is just, is very, it's a very neat little concept. It's just, it's very well executed. I love the art. Like, the art of this game, like, the whole way through. I haven't even seen all the art. I'm like, oh my god, I want to go get it. No, the, again, the Fury is, like, probably the one we have the least amount of. Also, the, uh, the, the spooky, the spooky lady, actually. Didn't get all of her. But, uh... Yeah, it was a good time. I, uh... I think this game is, all, is, is another one of those little spe spe special games I think everyone should play at some point. It's just very, very good. It's probably like the best visual novel, novel I've ever played. I think I've heard people also say that like it's one of like the best visual novels ever. It's also fully voice acted. Well, not fully voice. There's like, you know, some of the little things here and there that's like, you don't read that because the narrator is not doing that or the voices or whatever and the princess, you know, they're not reading because it it's supposed to be you. Right. Only besides like that. But it's basically fully voice acted, right? It's basically fully voice acted. Which is great. Especially for streamers, so they don't kill their voices doing all the voices and stuff, and I didn't have to voice the princess. Oh my god. I mean, I have a voice changer, but you know. You know. Uh. Yeah, I really like, I really like, I really like this whole game. It's, it's very, it's very, it's very nice. Good, 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 good little game. Uh, so I don't know why. I, don't, I, don't, I really don't know why the whole time we're like a bird, right? We're like a bird, a bird man kind of, kind of thing. I don't know. I think like we're kind of like different from what the narrative looks like. I think, I think we have a beak. I don't know. I just don't want us to have a beak. I don't really, I don't really like beaks. Uh, <laughs> you know, I don't know. I don't know. That's just me. I don't really, I don't care for beaks. After Dark Special. Uh, But, uh, yeah. So, that's gonna be it for Celestia the Princess, as I've said before. Uh, I don't know. I might stream tomorrow? I don't know. It's just, it's just I do, like, work tomorrow, but I think, I'm, think I'll be able to get home tomorrow. 
Uh, because if I do stream tomorrow, we will be starting. This is the next game we're going to be playing. Is fucking like a dragon, infinite wealth, or Yakuza 8. Lad, lad 8. It's, it's, it's the 8th game. It's infinite. The infinite sign makes an 8. It's the 8th game. In the, no, I know there's more than that, but no, it's the 8th. In the nut, in the, whatever, it doesn't matter. Um, yeah, so we'll be starting that up either tomorrow or like Tuesday at the latest, at the latest. Uh, cause I feel like, I feel like tomorrow be, might be the only day cause I'd like to, I'd like to work on the clip thing I'm trying to want to do. That's probably what I do on Friday, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, the Slayer Prince is really great. Again, I highly recommend picking it up yourselves if you want to see more of it or if you just kind of like dip it in, like in and out, like, uh, like what happened to it. It's like, you, should, you, should, you, you ought to yourself to play it because it's very fun. Uh, it's, it's very, it's, it's sad. It's horrific. It's, it's heartwarming, romantic even. And it's, it's spooky. It's a little spooky sometimes. You know? It's good. It's good. Uh, but yeah. So, we'll see. Uh, if I don't stream tomorrow, I'll probably just be working on, like, the clip thing. I kind of want to get out on the clip channel. I'm trying to get the clips on out there, you know? I'm trying to get them, you know? At least once a week, or try to. I don't know. I just, I'll, be try, I'll just try my best out here, man. I'll be, I'll, I'll be, just, I'll be just out here trying my best. Um, but anyway, I hope all of you have yourselves a good fucking rest of your day. And, uh, I may or may not see you tomorrow to start our Christmas vacation in Hawaii with fucking Ichiban and Kiryu because, oh boy. Oh boy, I hope you're ready for another Yakuza adventure because it's been a, it's, it's been a bit. It's been, it's been, wait, did we, hold on, did we play, hold on, wait, hold on, wait, hold on, when did, when did we play, when did, when did, when did, when did we play, uh, Titan, was that, was that this year, was that last year, hold on, I have to, hold on, when, did I show up early or what? Guidance. Did we did worry with then? Did we Oh yeah, near incarnation dead this year. I cry. Um do that. When did I do this? When did I ten months ago? December. No, okay, no. Okay, okay, no, that was that that was, that was last year. Yeah, because we always gotta do Yakuza on, on the Christmas time. I was I wasn't sure. Anyway, anyway, I've been I've been I've been, I've been rambling and whatever. Uh again. I hope we see you guys tomorrow. Maybe some more Yakuza? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. See what happens. See what happens. Anyway, you guys go fucking have yourselves a good fucking rest of the day. And I We'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. I have to go dance in the stars with the princess or something and be happy until it all gets taken away from me again and we start and we just come back and then we do it again and then we come back and we do it again <laughs> the tights all the loop it's a it's one uh, anyway goodbye